Lucas Marine Oil. It's the only oil fortified with unique Lucas additives. <laughs> Just like Major League Fishing, it's environmentally friendly. Sweet. Lucas Oil means purpose-built, high-performance product. It meets all manufacturers' specifications also. Not running Lucas Marine Oil, it's like fishing a tournament without a boat. Lucas Marine Oil, it's that good. More than a century ago, General Tire was born, right here in America. Since then, we've made a name for ourselves by making tires you can depend on. Tires built to handle any road this country can throw at them, and relied on by every kind of driver. So you know that no matter where life takes you, with General Tire, anywhere is possible. B&M Poles the number one crappie pole company in the world. More tournament wins than any other crappie pole. BNMPoles.com Clean up your toughest messes super easy, super fast. Only Super Clean is formulated to do the work for you. Just spray it on and watch the grease and grime wash away. Super Clean is the only cleaner degreaser that is scientifically formulated to kick any mess to the curb. So you can move on to more important things. For all of your greasiest, grimiest, toughest tasks around the house, shop, or garage, Super Clean gets the job done. Super Clean, super easy, super fast. All right, and welcome to ACT Live. I'm James Bryant, right alongside with Angie Morgan. And it's Championship Saturday. Angie, what about that? That's right. Blast Off this morning was amazing. Guys did a great job, and after that national anthem played, they were ready to go out there and catch some fish. You know, this is history with the uh, crappie fishing and with the American Crappie Trail. Once again, advancing ourselves into the industry as the leaders in innovative and transparent and fair fishing. This blast off is the most amazing thing I've seen in crappie fishing yet. Correct. Would you want, you want to kind of explain to all of our viewers what we're doing? Yeah, absolutely. So um, we have a computer program that randomly assigns their boat numbers. Uh, we put them into flights, and in the morning we do a blast off. They go out, they have to be in the water by a certain time. We play the national anthem, and then we start blasting them off. So we start at one, and we go all the way through our boats for day one. And then on day two, we invert the field so that we're making things fair. Everyone's getting the same amount of fishing time between day one and day two. So no more trailering, no more getting off the water, no more moving around. Everybody takes off from one location comes back right here to Paris Landing, we weigh them, we pay them, and we're done. Absolutely correct. Awesome, awesome. So let's talk about fishing a little bit. We're hearing all kinds of stories out there about live scoping, and I heard a new term yesterday called um, spider scoping, like spider rigging with live scopes with and different the live things. Scope yeah. so they can see it all. Yep, so it's going to be really interesting. Lots and lots of stake beds out there, lots of guys fishing. Who's your pick today? Ooh, I don't know. I mean, the live scopers are doing well. Um, I mean, Josh Jones surprised us all yesterday he thought maybe he'd bring in eight pounds and he led for most of the day but you know tony hughes and jeff riddle this is our home lake they've never won a tournament here i mean couple of great guys it'd be great to see them finally bring one home well they're not any strangers to winning with the act oh they're not they won our championship last year they sure did so they're no strangers to being up there at the top and i'm sure they're going to pull out everything they can to make sure that they win this tournament absolutely you know i we've got uh high tech outdoors about 45 miles from here. They have done an amazing job. Matt Quinn, he has kept our guys back on the water. Um, and I've just got to give a huge shout out to Matt at High Tech, High Tech Outdoors. Um, we've had anglers that drove over to see him and could, had nothing but praise to say about how he was able to not only fix electronics, trolling motors, any problems that these guys have had, he got them back out on the water so that they could fish on tournament day. It's always great when we come to a community and the, and the businesses support our anglers and help them out and it's saying get back on the water and compete so they're not going home. That's the big thing. I mean, we want everyone to have that opportunity to take home that new Ranger boat. Well, so we're here at Paris Landing and uh, we're going to wrap it up today and we're going to give somebody a Ranger boat and a boatload of money. That kind of a, that's uh, no pun intended there. Yeah, a yeah. boatload of money. But let's talk about our next stop. Next stop is going to be Wachita River, August 28th and 29th down in Monroe, Louisiana. 
That's home of Duck Dynasty, I believe, right? Correct. West Monroe. West Monroe. We'll be in West Monroe. Correct. Uh, great ice cream shop down there where we stayed last time. I kind of liked having that ice cream. You're always about your sweets. I like my sweets. <laughs> then, after we hit uh, West Monroe at the Wachita River, we're moving on to... Grenada, which had to be rescheduled. Um, so we will be in Grenada September 11th and 12th. And then our final stop is going to be Ross Barnett October 23rd and 24th. And that's going to tell us who's going to get our invite to our 2020 National Championship at the Alabama River in the March of 2021. Right. And I'll tell you what, Grenada was a, um, that was a destined not to happen. We had uh, COVID and had to put it off and then finally flooded. we broke through. Yep. Then it flooded. So I think September fishing at Grenada is going to be absolutely amazing. We're really excited about it. And folks, if you're watching for the first time and you want to be part of uh, fishing the professional field, come join us with American Crappie Trail. All you have to do is just log on to AmericanCrappieTrail.com, go down to the rules, register, sign up, come join us. It'll be a great time. Absolutely. You know, and I can say that here at Kentucky Lake, this is our fourth year coming here. And every year we have teams that are new to us. We have a team that they fished one other tournament before and they decided it was a local club tournament and they wanted to get in the big game. It is. It's great. And, you know, every year we come back to Kentucky, the fishing is getting better and better. I mean, we saw six teams break the 10 pound barrier and I think nobody thought we'd see anything over nine pounds. Absolutely true. And it's great to see, too, that they're catching bigger fish on tournament day than they thought they were going to catch from practice. I know. So I think today, Championship Saturday, I think we might see some surprises. I think so. All right. Well, I think that wraps it up, doesn't it? Yep. Guys, we want to thank you for tuning in to ACT Live. Wayne's is going to be coming up real soon. Thanks for tuning in. As always, Angie, a pleasure. Thank you. And guys, stick around. We'll be right back. From the tackle store to your truck. To your boat on the lake. Back to the ramp and all the way home. Angle coolers have you covered. As a professional angler, my success is directly related to my preparation. In a tournament, I may cover hundreds of miles of water in one day. That's thousands of miles in a year just getting to the fish. I use Lucas Oil products to ensure my success on the water. Lucas Oil, made in America, sold to the world. Nearly half a million dollars on the line. Yo! And it all comes down to ounces. 1076, down and ridden! Don't miss a second of the newest and richest crappie trail in the country, the American Crappie Trail, presented by Lucas Oil. Woo! Watch Pursuit Channel. Fox Sports South and Midwest for all the action. We're ready to go now. The future of crappie fishing is here. The American Crappie Trail. Love it. Living the dream, folks. Living the dream. The American Crappie Trail is brought to you by these fine sponsors. Lucas Oil Marine Products. Lucas Oil Outdoor Line. Protect the Harvest. B&M. O'Reilly Auto Parts. Millennium Marine. General Tire. Super Clean. Angle Coolers. Racetrack. Power Pole. Hook. Roadrunner. Bobby Garland, The Bass Tank, Crappie Magnet, Rod Socks, Mid-South Tackle, Ranger Boats, Crappie Now, Driftmaster, Grizzly Jig Company. And now, welcome to the ACT stage, Waymaster James Bryant. 
All right, folks, welcome everybody for tuning in to American Crappie Trail Live. I'm James Bryant. Thanks for tuning in. A little bit of housekeeping right now. We had some early weigh-ins today, and the current leaders are Maviano and Wrecker with 1702. Yesterday, our big fish was 186. So we're getting ready to go into championship Saturday and find out who's going to walk away with that new Ranger boat and the coveted title of the super clean champions here at Kentucky Lake at Paris Landing. So what we're going to do is we're going to bring up some anglers here in just a quick second as soon as Angie gets them all going here. We're ready to bring up a team, boat number 38 of Ronnie Caps and Steve Coleman. Yesterday they had 826. They're going to need 870. Oh, I said that backwards, guys. You had 876. You're going to need 826 to move into the lead today. Come on up and join me. How you guys doing today? I heard you had a big string today. Is this true? Oh, man, we had a, had a great morning, you know, and it just bothers us when we think we're going to lose a fish. So, you know, we got seven nice ones and figured we better try to get them here live. So we, we cut it short today. All right. Well, you know what they always say whenever I get over here? You say rock and roll. I, I tell you what, uh, it's been a lot better day today. Good. Yeah. A lot of big fish and a lot of numbers of them. Are you guys ready to find out? We're we, we ready. All right, let's see here, guys. Championship Saturday for Ronnie Caps and Steve Coleman, and they are going to have right up there 1068. 1068, two day total of 1944. You guys are in the lead right now, and we're going to have big fish to weigh, correct? Uh, yeah, uh, we shouldn't. Yeah. <laughs> we shouldn't. 186 is the current big fish right now. Hmm. All right. 158, guys. 158. Is it going to stick? Hang on. I think it's on. No, it's not going to stick, but it's, got, uh, it's a good improvement, though. Right on. Yeah. Any guys you'd like to thank today for being up here? Oh, man, being in Poe, super clean, you know, that's, uh, that's our bread and butter, what it is, you know. If it wasn't for them, we wouldn't be here. There you go. Well, guys, hope we'll see you here in a little bit. Up top 10, maybe you have the hot seat. What do you think? Oh, that, that sounds great. You know, um, you know it. This, this thing has got some of the best crappie fishermen in the whole United States showing up here, man. And it is a, it is a mind game sometimes to, to jog around what you're going to do and, you know, try to, try to figure out a plan. And we, we made a terrible mis mistake yesterday, you know, a mental mistake, actually. But we uh, went with it, and that's, what we, that's how we ended up. You know, hindsight's twenty twenty always. But anyway, I can't say enough about American Crappie Trail and having these tournaments for us. I mean, I, you know... There's bumps in the road for everything, and, and I'm telling you, we missed fishing for quite a few months. So we're proud to be back and proud to be here. Um, can't wait to see how it ends up. And first term of the year, you guys are going to move way up in the point standings and go for that third, fourth. How many angler years you guys got already with them? Oh, uh, I don't know. Uh, you know, a lot. Things have changed a lot uh, since uh, you know we've won a couple, but um, we'll see how it goes. There you go, guys. Hey, pleasure as always. Congratulations, guys. Hope to see you after a while. Thanks, Steve. All right, next up on the stage, we have boat number 34. They're the Jenko sponsored fishing team of Jake, Jason Eichwurzel Ike, and Parker Eichwurzel. Got seven fish alive today. Had a tough day, guys, yesterday, huh? Yes, sir. Good day. How you doing? Uh, pretty good. All right, well. A lot better today. A lot better today, right? Fish is alive today. All right, we're going to need 1944 to move into the lead, so let's see what we got here, okay? We're going to have 884, guys. 884, and we got a big fish we're going to weigh. Let's weigh him. There's some good fish in there today. Let's get, as soon as I find which one was marked there, because it's supposed to be quicker, right? Where is he? Come here, Parker. Help me out here. You know, the big one always goes to the bottom, right? Wait a minute. Found him. There he is. All right. Let's get you going here. Whoop. There we go. Well, we got close, guys. 174, 174. Parker, grab that guy, hold him up, show everybody what that Kentucky Lake fish is. Oh, got him. I'll give you that ticket. Grab this microphone. While he's getting all the glory, you want to talk about who got you here? Man, yes. Uh, we had a great week uh, just being up here anyway. We had a terrible week fishing. But uh, I got to thank Jinko, Rod Sox. You know, Matt and Angie, everyone that helps put this on, you know, this wouldn't be possible without all these sponsors behind us. Uh, and you, Jamie, hey, you do a heck of a job. I appreciate that. I just call the weights, though. You have to catch them before I can do anything. Oh, yeah, but, you know. I got you. Did he miss anything, Parker? You nope. You guys good? All right. Congratulations. Good to see you guys. Hope to see you at Wachita. Thanks, Parker. Get your fish there. You got your ticket. We're good. 
All right, next up, we have the Cornfield Crappie Sponsor Team, boat number 43, Jason Hotson Pillar and Adam McLeod. Got a seven fish limit today, had 9.08 today, need 10.36 to move into that coveted first spot. How you doing, buddy? Gonna be close. Close? Yeah. What do you think, you good? I don't know. Never All right, know. let's find out, guys. Seems like the fish is a little better today, huh? Yeah. Does feel like a pretty good sack, guys. And you did. Look at this. First 11-pound break, 11.10. Going to put you to a total up at 20.18, guys. Good job. Good job. All right. Let's get that big fish here going. I'll get him there for you if you want to look for him. All right. That's fine. 11 pounds. Look at that. I think we've got a 186 we're going to beat here, guys. Let's go. You did. Look at there. A two-pound break. 207, guys. 207. Awesome, awesome. Grab that guy and show off the world what you just did at Kentucky Lake. All right, two first on uh, championship Saturday. The first guys to break the 11-pound bear, first got Brian to break a two-pound fish. How's that feel? Man, it was pretty good today. We had a couple, uh, couple good fish there, and, man, I, they just, we just can't get them to stay alive. You know, we were nervous. We caught them in deep water. Put that big one in the live oil just a, a few minutes ago, and man, it just didn't look right. And I told him, I said, we got to go. We can't be weighing in dead fish. So, weighing in early. I don't know. We did it yesterday, too. Just worried about the fish. We had boat problems. It's been a long, long tournament. So, well, maybe. everybody's wondering, so I didn't give it up. How'd you get them today? Oh, just, oh, just small baits. Small baits. 30 second ounce hair jig. Yep. 30 second ounce hair jig, says yeah. Adam. Yep. Every fish. All right. Yep. Let's talk about who got you here today. Well, I tell you who really got us here is uh, Mark Riddle at Cornfield Crappie Gear. Man, without him, he saved us yesterday, got us towed in, swapped boats, all the – and I went to his shop, put on – we put on some new electronic mounts on the way down, stopped by. We had like 20 minutes. We swapped electronic mounts, hooked us up with that, and yesterday we had to rebuild my – basically my back into my lower lower unit. Did it at his shop last night, got my boat back on the water. He really took care of us. Uh, I'd like to also thank Donnelly Marine and Jetta Marine. They got me my parts and uh, really helped out there yesterday. There you go. Did a pit stop and got her back on the racetrack, right? That's right, man. It was been a couple pit stops this week. All right, Adam, so what do you think? How long is this going to hold for you? Good for the whole duration? I doubt it, man. There's some really good teams coming that are on good fish. We, uh, we slipped yesterday, so I don't know if it's going to hold up. But Well, I think it's a good zig instead of a zag today. Yeah. No, hey, guys. can prove it. Congratulations. We'll hope to see you here in the top 10 and shoot out here in just a little bit. Great job. Great weights. All right. Coming up next, boat number 30. They are the, another cornfield crappie gear team of Dale Willingham and Timmy Christ. Had a uh, tough go yesterday, 477. Had a tough go today, another three fish. Good to see you guys. Good to see you. Got three fish. We're going to weigh here for you. Going for those coveted points towards angle of the year and getting to that national championship. And that's what counts right now. Of course, these are alive. 342, two day total of 819. Tell me about your day, Dale. Well, that started out during the week. On the way here, um, I lost about $400, $400 worth of crankbaits, flew out of the boat, three thirty seven hundred 3,700 cases. So we got here, uh, pre fish fine, everything was good. It didn't work for us yesterday. And today, we started out with the trim not working coming up. So we stayed out there until I got a barb in my hand and Jamie took it out for me the second time after doing his Yeah, don't, don't tell anybody I, I, I dug in the hook the first time. We don't <laughs> want to talk about that. It getting it out the second time. I think it, it went counts. deeper the first time. <laughs> yeah. <I'd laughs> you got it out the second time, and really it doesn't really bother me right now, so that's good. Oh, it will later. Don't worry about yeah, that. Yeah. So, Timmy, were you terrified that your injury was coming next? Uh, yes, I was. I figured you were. Guys, <laughs> I appreciate it. Oh, I want to give a shout-out to uh, High Tech Outdoors. That's another thing. Our units weren't sharing information. We had to shoot up there. He got our units running for us. Market Cornfield Crappie Gear, of course, with our mounts. Um, Jayco Fishing, Hubie's Outdoors. Uh, they got that outdoor thing coming down at Hubie's Marine also. And all our other sponsors, Muddy Water Baits. Timmy? Got it, Timmy. Nope, got it. I'd like to thank Sea Plant Credit Union, Smokey D's Barbecue, Tyler Pittman, Woodman Life, and Crappie Shack in Baduca. You got her, guys. Thanks much. We'll see you at Watch Talk. Thank you very much. Why don't you weigh and take it, guys? Here you go. Timmy, I'll give you this, and I'll give you this. You take out the boat. Thank you, guys. Got it? All right. All right. Next up on the ACT Championship Saturday stage here, beautiful Paris Landing on Kentucky Lake, we're going to have boat number 56. They are the team of Jeff Bookwalter and Dennis Snyder. Had 8-11 yesterday. Going to need 12-07 to move into the lead. 
And guys, I hope my screen's not reading right. Is it? It is right, buddy. All right. We, uh, we fell off the face of the earth today. Yeah. Uh, what? We were on good fish yesterday, pulling crankbaits. We couldn't get a bite other than catfish on them cranks today. So we switched up about 8 o'clock, done some single pulling, which we're very inexperienced with, still catching catfish. And uh, then we put all eight out and pushed for a while and got some white bass. So we are got one crappie today. Multifaceted fishing today, all right? Dennis, let's go find out what you got here. Because we're talking about points, too. And I, I told a guy earlier today, it's not, let me get this weight here for you. We're at 0.84 pounds. going to bring you a two-day total of 8.95. I told a guy earlier, he said, man, I didn't do very good today. And I said, you know, there's going to be thousands and thousands of people watching online dreaming they were doing what you were doing. So, hey, congratulations on a great weekend here at Kentucky Lake. Yeah, it was fun. It was tough. We didn't have a lot of pre-fish, so we just uh, done what we done. We're gonna we're gonna hit it again next time. You want to talk about who's paying the bills for you? Um, yeah, uh, or sponsor you, or offer you some cool stuff. That's that's the best part. Uh, some Lorico jig heads we use a lot of. Uh, sore mouth tackle, uh, my trucking company, and uh, trying to think who else. Tackle Nation there. They're going to be an on online website here. They're coming soon, so you can, you can go there and get everything you need to go fishing. Cool, Dennis. Did he miss anything? Uh, probably rod socks, copy monster, and sore mouth tackle. Perfect, guys. Appreciate you fishing with us. Hope we see you at Watch Talk. Thank you. Now, here's your waiting ticket. Yep. Thank you, guys. Yeah. All right. Next up is boat 19. Bruce McCaig and Tim Crawford had 214 yesterday. Got another three today to put them on the board. How you doing? All right, let's get you here. Going to add to it, we've got 259 for a two-day total of 473. Are we talking today? Not talking. How about you? Want to do something? Uh, we had a great time. All right. A little warm, but had a good time. Anybody you'd like to thank today while you're online? Uh, Bruce there. He... Bruce is a good guy, isn't he? Isn't he, though? Yeah, he Sometimes. is. Sometimes. He's a lot of fun. I've known him for a couple of years now. He's a... Not a big talker, but he's a good no, guy. That's good, right? That's good. Good. I appreciate Thank you fishing with Thanks so much. Take care now. Here we go. Next up, we have boat number five, Brian Cleland and Duffy Cleland. Had 8.57 yesterday. Got seven fish alive today. Need to turn my microphone back on. And you're going to need 11.61 to move into the lead. And the question is, do you have 11.61 today? We're going to fall a little short. A little short, <laughs> but good fish it looks like. We got some good fish, but not, not that kind of quality. Well, let's find out. What do you say, Dad? I think we'll uh, have at least uh, eight pounds. All right, let's find <laughs> out, guys. To the scale we go, and you did. Come on, eight oh two. You hit it right on the money, man. Two day total of sixteen fifty nine, just three pounds short of the lead, but not bad for a two day total here at Kentucky no, Lake. It was a blast. We we caught a lot of fish and uh, beautiful weather. Can't ask for anything better. All right, well we got to talk a little business now. Anybody you guys like to thank this weekend? I uh, would like to thank some of our sponsors, Bonehead Tackle. Uh, <laughs> Thank ACT. Uh, thank ACT for having this event. Right on. <laughs> so, um, Did I put you on the spot? <laughs> yeah. Are you married? He usually talks. No. Nope. Girlfriend? Yes. Why don't you acknowledge her? Yeah. Shelby, I love you. Right on. Good call. How about you now? Tammy, hello. Thanks for letting me come. There you go. To all the ladies, thanks for letting us guys fish. Appreciate it, guys. Thank you very much. There you go. We'll give you a, a wet weighing ticket. There you go. All right. All right, next up, we have boat number two. They are the B&M Pro Staff Sponsored Team, along with Ingle Coolers. Terry Stewart and Cole Stewart had 9-12 yesterday. They've got seven fish alive today, and they're going to need approximately, uh, not approximately, 11.06 to move into the lead. Get this guy turned on, and welcome back to Championship Saturday. How you doing? Thank you, Jamie. Good, man. We're glad to be here. Uh, a little little tough again out there, but, hey, we had a, had a great time, and like I say, we were Sweating at getting seven fish, really. I mean, it was uh, just places that we had been weren't, you know, wasn't producing today. So we, we went to some areas that we didn't spend a whole lot of time pre-fishing. But thankfully, we, we found some and were able to get seven and upgrade a little bit. So, so it is an upgrade. Yes, sir. Let's from, find out. From, from 10 o'clock this morning, it's a big upgrade. Not from yesterday. I'm sorry. Yes, sir. Okay, yes, got sir. you. Upgrade. Got it. Let's see what we got here. Oh, I think you did upgrade, actually. Uh, I don't think so. Yeah, you did, see? Wow. Well. 953, two-day total of 1865. Pretty good day for you guys. Right now, sitting in third place. 
Well, that's surprising, but hey, we're not going to argue with you. That's right. We've uh, talked about it before. I mean, this is the first year. I know we're way into the year, but this is the first one for the points race. First one to get to the national championship. 18 and a half pounds, nothing to be ashamed of at all. No, sir. Like I say, we're, we're, we're thankful, man. It can be, any lake, you know, can be tough one day to another. You know, you'll, you'll see it. You always do. Some folks are going to do better. Some are, are not. And uh, like I say, we're, we're pretty surprised, really, that, uh, you know, we ended up, because we were, we were struggling pretty good early this morning. So all it's right. uh, been a great time. Are we still doing a elimination tournament? Yes, we are. Oh, okay, this this might be it. <laughs> no, I mean not. Yeah, I mean not not That's like a three day championship. You get to drop yeah. one overall. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. Exactly. yeah. Yeah. That's good. So well. let's talk about some logo placements. Yes, sir. Uh, <laughs> man, we want to we want to thank uh, Engel Coolers, uh, American Crappie Trail, especially all all you guys, Jamie, Matt, and Angie. Uh, the whole ACT crew, uh, B and M Poles, uh, Jack Wells, Kent Driscoll. Um, Man, they, they've got some great products, and we appreciate everything they help us with. Uh, uh, Pro-built jigs, uh, uh, let's see, Crappie G hair jigs out of Louisiana, Mr. Greg Davis. Uh, Thump Crappie Co., Mr. Donnie Carter out of Oklahoma. Uh, appreciate, appreciate everything they do. Miss Ann with Rod Sox. Uh, all the sponsors with ACT that sponsor everybody, man, and our local clubs, Magnolia Crappie Club. I want to thank my wife back home. Uh, and like I say, we just appreciate everything y'all do for us for everything that's going on and still put these events on. It's a lot of lot of hard work on y'all's part, and we we appreciate it. We enjoy it too. Cole, did he get any ever oh, get it all? He, he covered it all. He did good. Are you sure? I think so. And nobody made funny in the background behind you this time. You got to actually Not, just tune I know. it in. I appreciate Wasn't that funny? That. I yeah. appreciate that wherever he yeah. is. You can call him out. It's all good. <laughs> so yeah, it's all good. Guys, congratulations on a great two day. We Thanks, appreciate fishing with. Hope we see you at Watchtower. All yes, right. Here's your weigh-in ticket. Thanks. Thanks, Cole. See you guys. All right, moving on. Watch those. Yeah, you. Watch those greats, man. Make your feet hurt. Yeah, it does for me. I tried doing it earlier. Boat number 46, Blake Phillips, Phillips with the eye hole jig. Come on, everybody. How you doing? Good. Had 792 yesterday. Fell three fish short of limit today, but you're going to need 1226 to move into the lead. I don't think you're going to do it today. Man, they're huge. Well, if you got some four pounders in there, you got them. No, uh, uh, I'm just man. I'm just. I was thinking about it all day. I had a bunch of problems, and I, I went, went to get upset. And I was like, wait a minute. There's so many people that would love to be in my position right now, and how can I get upset? So, I mean, just God bless everybody. God bless the United States right now, and I want to thank God and Reese. And it's not you can tell right now because my weights. It wasn't Reese's fault. Ah, well, you know. She always it's not, it's not Reese's fault. I'm the one that's not any good at it. I was going to say, it was a lot better when she was here. Oh, God, yeah. It's so much funner. <laughs> oh, my God. I can find let's, everything. Let's see what we got here, buddy. Let's put them on the scale here. Oh, I didn't go weigh them. I didn't care. No, nah, we're weighing them. We're going to weigh them. It's about points. 398 two-day total of 1190, my friend. That's what hurts. It was about points. That's right. <laughs> it hurts. hurts it's hurts. all right. You're on a good start for the beginning of the year. So I'm going to give you that ticket, Blake. It's a pleasure seeing you again. Hope to see you at Wachita. Love you guys. Love you too. There you go. Grab your fish. We'll see you on the next one. All right, moving on. We have the Crappie Monster Pro Staff, Pro Staff Team of Jeremy Mattingly and James Minton. Had a pretty good day yesterday, 951. How you doing? Welcome to Championship Saturday. Glad to be here, man. Glad to be here. Need Had 10. Awesome got seven live today. Need 1067. Do you got them? Uh, well, we got seven fish. What'd you say we had to have? 1067. No. All right, no. let's find out, though. I'm going I'm to guess at about 890. You're pretty close. 904 for a two-day total of 1855 right now. Put you in about the fourth spot. Good deal, good deal. That is unofficial, of course. I do want to say one thing about Far this, away. Uh, this lake. There ain't nobody out there that can say anything bad about the crappie fishing at Kentucky Lake right now. We have caught a blue million good fi We have caught a blue million good fish. Uh, while we were here and caught some real dandies. We just failed to do it on tournament day. Did you say blue million? Blue million. I've never heard that term. What does blue million mean? Well, it, it means a whole bunch. Where are you from again? <laughs> Missouri. You're from Missouri, and I'm from Missouri. I've never heard the term blue million in my life. I, I'm right here. Well, not right here. I've heard of literally, I've literally caught a million. I've caught you know, like a, a plethora. You've heard that one? No, sir. Never heard of a plethora of fish? You ever heard of a plethora? It's a plethora. But yeah. you're Missouri, too. Never mind. Yeah. yeah, James and I got it. We know what plethora is, right? Yeah. But he's got a blue millions. So that's okay. Yep. All right, let's talk about some sponsor coverage here. 
Uh, I'd like to thank uh, B&M Poles. Uh, they set us up with uh, all the stuff, the, the tools to get the job done. Uh, Badger Bait Bar, uh, they help us out and make some great products. We've got Super Clean, and got to keep everything clean, right? Um, Chris Propane and uh, Mark Riddle over at uh, Cornfield Crappie. I'm trying not to forget nobody, but I, I bet I am. Uh, Blake Phillips set us up with some jigs uh, from uh, IHO Jigs. Uh, the only thing I really have to say is since this is Father's Day's weekend is uh, happy Father's Day to my dad and all the other fathers out there. Very good. James, appreciate it, guys. Jeremy, good to see you guys. Hope to see you at Watch Thanks, All right. Thank you very much. All right. Next up on the American Crappie Trail on Championship Saturday right here in Paris, Tennessee, a beautiful Kentucky lake here in the sweltering heat. We've got boat number 63, the team of Roger Gant and Neil Whitley. Guys, seven fish today, had 636 yesterday, need 1382 to move into that coveted first spot. You got them? No, they're not. Light. No. All right, but we do have seven alive. Good yes, ones today? Yes, we do. No, we caught a lot of fish, but they're small. All right, let's see what we got, guys. To the scales we go. Almost did the same thing. 626 for a two-day total of 1262. Don't have a big fish to weigh. So let's talk about who you'd like to thank this weekend. Well, I'd like to thank Matt and Angie. It's, it's a real nice tournament. We've had a good time. Uh, this lake's down from what it used to be. But there's still a lot of fish out there, and one day maybe it'll come back. There you go. Neil, Did he? Uh, anything you'd like to add? Uh, no, we did it best we could. We just stayed on them. Well, guys, it was a pleasure meeting you guys again. Good to see you up on the stage. Hope we see you next one. All righty, guys, thank you much. I'll give you this one, and I'll hand you your fish back, and go see Mr. Buzz. All right, moving on. Had uh, 378 yesterday, got two today. Boat number six, Cody Deaton and Ryan Lusby. The Crappie Monster Pro Staff team. I'm not picking on you, but tough weekend? It was a real tough weekend. First time on Kentucky Lake, first ACT. Uh, we'll be back. Well, welcome aboard, guys. We sure appreciate it. I'm gonna, I've said this a million times. I'm going to say it again. Uh, there's a bunch, a bunch of guys out there dreaming they were staying up here right now. So congratulations if you guys for getting here in the first place. Yeah, we appreciate it. It's a tough you. go, isn't it? It was tough, but uh, we'll come back again. Right on. Ryan, how was it? It was uh, eventful. What was your favorite part of the tournament? Uh, fishing. There you go. <laughs> Let's get it on the scoreboard, guys. We're collecting points right now. 154, two-day total of 532. Anybody you guys like to thank this weekend? Hey, we want to thank uh, Crappie Monster, um, and I'm sure Ryan's got some more than that. All right, Ryan. Uh, Crappie Monster, Rod Sox, and Jack and Jigs. There you go. Guys, congratulations on competing in the ACT stage. Looking forward to seeing you at the next one. Appreciate it a bunch. Here's your weigh-in ticket. There you go. Thanks, guys. All right, next up, boat number 37, Rob Robinson, B&M Pro Staff Sponsored Angler. Had 892 yesterday. Got a trio today. Tough day. Tough day. Let's get you on the board, sir. No smiling today. Yeah. Done, aren't you? I'm, I'm cooked. Cooked. 354, two-day total of 1246. Let's get your thank yous out of the way. Uh, I'd like to thank B&M Poles and uh, all the folks that work at Robinson Electric for doing a good job allowing me to come fish. There you go. Rob, Bob, appreciate it as always. Pleasure. Hope to see you at the next one, all right? There you go, sir. Thank you. Here's your what you want your weigh ticket. There you go. Thank you. All right, next up, we have boat number 50. They're the Mr. Crappie Uptel sponsored team of Danny Rogers and Randy Harris. Had 879 yesterday. Do you have seven fish alive to bring to the scale today? And guys, welcome to Championship Saturday. How you doing, Danny? Good, good. Good. Randy? James, how you doing? Good. I'm good now. How was it? Good? Well, it was better today. Um, the fish, uh, we, we went about 20 miles further, and the fish were definitely bigger where we at today. And we saved it for day two on purpose, but uh, I don't, it's not, it helps some, but it's not going to get us where we need to be. All right. But, uh, you know, that's part of it. Their points. Maybe that's getting right. that check line. You never know, that's right? That's right. Let's find out. What do you say? Let's do it. They do look pretty good, guys. Let's see here. And you guys did do a lot better today. 919, two day total of 1798. Going to put you unofficially right now in fifth place. So, how about that? That's not bad, right? Well, there's a lot to go. Uh, we're seeing a lot of numbers really going uh, down, uh, so you guys went up, so maybe you'll be one of those hard chargers in the day. Right. I'd like to thank, uh, as far as our sponsors, I'd like to thank Pappy's. They were our title sponsor this time, and, and it takes a lot to keep us going. we got Mr. Crappie, 
uh, Lowe's, uh, Strike King, BBG Marine helps us with electronics, and and uh, Team Uptail, Patsy, uh, Ron, um, you know, FCA Outdoors, Prime One. It just takes a bunch to keep us going. Y'all know how it is. It's just uh, uh, every little bit helps. Randy, did you miss anything? Uh, just our families. I, I'd like to thank both of our families for letting us do what we do. And I, I enjoy it. All right. Good? Good. Yeah, my wife for sure. <laughs> thank God, too. <laughs> there you go. Guys, congratulations on ACT. Hope you guys get a check. All right. Appreciate it. Here's your weigh-in ticket, and we'll see you in the next one. Moving on here on Championship Saturday at Kentucky Lake, we've got boat number 39. Janko sponsored fishing team, Steve Ferguson, Frank Finley, had 966 yesterday. You guys had a good day yesterday. Good day. Followed up with another seven fish limit today. Yes, sir. And? It was tougher today. Tougher today? Think yeah. you went backwards? We, yes. They look, yeah. good. They look yeah. good in there, though. What do you say, Frank? You want to just find out what they got? I have no idea. All right, let's get you guys on the board here and see what we got here. You guys had a good day. 883 for a two-day total of 1849, which the number right now looks like everybody's going to be landing in fifth spot. You're in fifth spot unofficially right now. Long ways to go. There's been a lot that have weighed, but you just never know, right? No. You never know. That's we right. We moved up a long ways before, but I don't got much confidence today, and there's too many good ones here. Oh, with this heat and everything, they say yeah. consistency will get you a long way, though, yeah. and you guys sure did that. We'd like to thank all of our sponsors. It's too many of them to mention each one individually, but we will thank Jinko. Okay. And I'd like to thank my wife and God. There you go, Frank. Yeah, I thank the good Lord. Thank Matt and Angie and all the ACT team. They put on a heck of a tournament. And uh, we're tickled to be here. Aren't we all? It's been a long year, hasn't it? It's been a long year. And we're just on the first tournament. That's right. That's it was, right. It's an, awesome, <laughs> it's an awesome format. I love it. And we're ready for the next one. Sounds good. Guys, congratulations. Hope we see you at the next one, okay? Appreciate it. Y'all be safe. Maybe we'll see in that check line later. Yeah. We'll see. Thanks, guys. All right, next up here on Championship Saturday, we have boat number three. They are the team of Eric Millsaps and Jonathan Brumley. Had 827 yesterday. A little short of limit today. They're going to need 1191 to take the lead. Guys, welcome to Championship Saturday. How are you doing today? Good to see you. Good. Good? Had to wait just a little bit, didn't you? Yep, a little warm. All right, you ready to get these fish on scale? Yep. All right, let's do it. Three good fish today. It's going to come in a little under three pounds, but 213 for a two-day total of 1040. 1040. Tell us about your experience here on Kentucky Lake, huh? I've uh, been here a few times, but it was good, as always. like coming down here. Gotcha. Anybody you guys like to thank this weekend? Yeah, I'd like to thank Joe Rosinski, uh, QPH, for getting us down here. Uh, Big Diddy Baits. Roadrunner Lures, um, Frog Togs. Very good. You want to add anything there, Chief? Uh, I'd just like to thank my mom and dad and MET. Right on. That's about it. It's good to see you guys up on the stage. Appreciate it. You. Guys, have a good trip. Thank you now. Here's your weigh-in ticket. There you go. Appreciate it. Got your fish? All right. Next up, we have got the B&M Pro Staff sponsored team of Jason Westerberg and Jim Westerberg. Had 794 yesterday. Going to need 1224 to move into the lead today. Got seven fish alive today. And it's a very special day because happy birthday. Thank you. Appreciate it. I was going to sing for you. Why didn't you? I, I still can. A, no, no, that's okay. What style would you like it in? Uh, country. Country? Yeah. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> happy All birthday right. to you. Happy birthday, dear Jason. All right. All right. Happy birthday to you. Yeehaw. Got it off. There you go. Happy birthday. All right. All right. So seven fish. I can give you that microphone because I'm going to waste some fish. Okay. I'll hand that to you. All right. How did I do, Jim? Was that good? You did good. You Thank did you. Good. It's kind of a little draw there. <laughs> All right. So we need a... Missouri draw. It was a Missouri. Yeah, not a very good one. It's kind of a hillbilly draw. But anyway, going to land in at 775 today oh, for yeah. a two-day total of 1569. Let's talk about the weekend real quick and all get right. your thank yous in and all that yeah. good stuff. Get you some birthday cake. There you go. I, we want to thank Bean and Pole Company. Uh, uh, crappie Magnet, Rockwell Rattler, uh, American Crappie Trail, uh, everybody here. You know, if we didn't have everybody here fishing, there wouldn't be anybody to fish against. So, <laughs> you know, hey, we learned a lot on Kentucky Lake this this trip. We learned a lot. We didn't do real good, but next time we will. I'll just say that. All right. I've well, learned a lot. Right now you're sitting in ninth place. Yeah. There's a lot of people coming up. I know, but you never, you just <laughs> never know. Some guys have good days. Some guys have bad days. Hey. 
We had a good day, no matter what. I got to fish with my dad again. There you go. And happy Father's Day there, Mr. Jim. Yep. Appreciate it. Thank you. Anything else? That's it. Happy birthday. Thank Appreciate you. it. You guys take care. Good to see you, Jim. Yeah. All right, next up, we have the team of Boat 44, Wes Cooper and Dan Hudgens. Had 948 yesterday. Pretty good day, guys. Following up with another seven fish limit. And the question is, is did you better yourself? We did not. Did not? No. Dan, how about it? We didn't. All right, let's find out, okay? They don't feel bad, though. No, it's all right. Yeah. I mean, we just couldn't get the big fish to bite. Well, we couldn't find the big fish today. I mean, it land in here. 867 yeah, for a two-day total of 1815. Not a bad day for you guys. And unofficially, it's going to put you in about sixth place right now. Yeah, that'll go down quick. <laughs> you think? I think, yeah. All right, well, let's talk yeah. about it. Anybody you guys like to thank this weekend? Oh, Matt, Angie, LJ, you, everybody, you know, puts it on. Uh, Paris, Tennessee, and... Uh, my wife, she just landed in Florida this morning. She's going to be there for a week. So even getting ready for that, she packed me a whole bunch of food and got me ready to roll. So love you, babe, uh, and Dan for putting up with me for a week. <laughs> there you go, Dan. Uh, it was a good week. He's a pretty good fisherman. So, you know, I just rode around and dipped him up. It was a pretty good, pretty good week. Right on. I uh, hope we got to see you guys in another tournament, all right? Yeah. We sure appreciate it, guys. Thank you. Thank you much now. I'll get your fish there. I'll get your weighing ticket. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it a bunch. Thanks for fishing with us. All right, next up, we have the team of Brody Roper and Tayton Roper. Had 464 yesterday. I think you guys bettered yourselves today, didn't you? Seven fish live. How you guys doing? Good to see you. Welcome aboard. How you doing? You're doing good. All right, good. come on over here. Let's talk. How was it today? Good. Good? Did you catch a fish today? No. No? Oh. Did you hold the net? No? You just watched Dad catch them all, huh? You dipped some up, didn't you? That's, you know what, this is called a team sport, so you get credit for everything he catches. Do you know that? That's right. So if he catches them, you catch them. You want to weigh and see what we got? Let's do it, okay? All right. Holy cow, Tayton, these look good. And they are. You guys did a bunch better job today. Yeah, okay. 668 for a two-day total of 1132. That's a lot of fish, isn't it? Yeah. All right, Dad. Let's talk about who you'd like to thank this weekend. I got to thank my wife. She made all the goodie bags for us for this week. Uh, fishing, and then Matt, Angie, you, Mr. Jamie, I mean, everybody here, Mr. Coleman for loading the boat. Y'all have made this little kid feel like a king all week long. I mean, he's top of the world right now. So Cool. Yeah, absolutely. All right, were you good? Do you have anything you want to say? Mm -mm. You want to do me a favor? Better, why don't you look at that camera and say hi to your mom. Hi, Mom. Who else? Did we miss it? That's it. All right, guys, we sure appreciate it. Thanks for fishing, Tayton. We sure enjoy you coming. Hope we see you again, okay? The next generation. All right, coming up next, we've got boat number 48, Kyle Seifert and Willis Nutt. Had a good day yesterday, 9.54, following up with another seven fish limit today. What do you think, guys? Uh, about the same. Let's find out, okay? Didn't have no big ones. No big ones. Hey, you did all right. You almost did the exact same thing, didn't you? Yeah, it's about, about the same fish. 9.43, two-day total of 18.97. Good two-day weekend for you guys. Not bad. Not, Not bad. Hot one. Yeah, I hear you there. No big fish to weigh, so let's talk about some sponsors. You got any? Nope. You fishing I'd out of your back pocket? Pretty much. Say thank you to me. Yep. <laughs> you guys split everything? Did you pick up the whole bill? Uh, we're, no. we're, we haven't evened up yet, but we're going to. Right on. Anybody you guys like to thank? Oh, yeah, the local guys that helped me out, you know, family restaurant. Um, Kyle and his old man for coming down here and pre-fishing all week while I was slaving away at work. Uh, they put me on some pretty good fish. They did really well pre-fishing, and, uh, I mean, it showed for itself. Awesome, awesome. Guys, appreciate you fishing with us. Hope we see you again, okay? Thank you very much. Got your fish there. Here's your weighing ticket. Thank you now. All right, next up, we have the Strike King Pro Staff Sponsor team of Tim Blackley and Daniel Porter. Had a tough go yesterday, 361, but they're going to follow up today with a good seven fish limit today, guys. Welcome to Championship Saturday. How you doing, Daniel? You good? Pretty good. How about you? Right on. Good. Tim, how you doing? Good. 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 Got it? Let's see what we did today, all right? Did well, you better it got, up? We got seven. You know what we're calling these today? 579 for two-day total of 940. These are called valuable, valuable points. Yeah, I guess so. We've just struggled all week. It's been, it's been a long week. Let's talk about some sponsors. Would you mind? Yeah. Uh, you know, Strike King helps us out. They give us all the good baits to catch a fish. Uh, B&M Pose couldn't do it without them. And American Crappie Trail, putting on a good trail. There you go. Daniel, is there anything you'd like to add? Thinks he hit it, guys. Thanks. Oh, let's get it. If you fish tournaments, 
long enough, you're going to have a bad one, and I'm glad we got this one out of the way. There you go. Well, you guys are no strangers staying there at the top of the, of the heap, and you've both have fished different teams and put it together. But uh, like you said, one misstep, and it'll cost you at this level quite a bit. Yep. It's fishing shallow here just don't work. There you go. <laughs> guys, I know you're going to be bouncing back. We'll be seeing you again. Thanks again. Appreciate it. That's your fish, Tim. Thank you. All right, next up we have the Racetrack Pro Staff sponsored team of Shannon Beckman and Kyler Beckman. They were mid-pack guys, started out strong, 950, followed up with another seven fish limit today. Yes, is sir. it better or worse? I don't have a clue what it is, to be honest. Didn't even you. weigh a one, huh? No. How many fish did you catch today? Oh, uh, well, I don't know what. I don't 20, maybe, maybe 20. All right. Yeah. What do you think there, Chief? Uh, we ain't got them. Don't have them. Let's find out, guys. They feel pretty good, though. You guys had another almost a cookie-cutter day, didn't you? 940 for a two-day total of 1890. 1890 is going to put you guys right now tentatively in about fourth spot. Not bad. Not bad. There's a lot of people to weigh in, though. <laughs> I've seen some ups and downs, though, so, I mean, yeah. hard to say, right? It's hard to say. All right, let's hard talk about some sponsors. You want to? Of course, uh, Jinko Fishing, Pro Built Jigs, JB's Fish Sauce, uh, Slime Line. That's the only line I use. We caught all of our fish on, uh, well, actually, we caught them on a whole bunch of different things, Pro Built Jigs and Jinko Baits, but... Uh, Racetrack, couldn't do it without racetrack, Lucas Oil, um, HH Reels, who else we got? I want to thank, uh, I want to thank my wife and the good Lord for letting us all be here and, you know, America's in one heck of a mess right now and it's just absolutely wonderful to see what's going on here, you know. That's nice to get back in the groove, isn't it? Yes, it is. It Even is. if you're here, too. Even if I'm But here. I'm glad you are. I'm just giving you a hard time. I appreciate it, guys. Good to see you guys. Hope we see you at Watchita, okay? Thank you, Shannon, Kyler. Appreciate it. Yep. There, get your waiting ticket. Good points. It's a good start for you guys. Yep. All right, next up, we have the Strike King and Lose Pro Staff Sponsored Team of Boat 61, Brad Woody and Duke Montgomery. Had 621 yesterday. Guys, you need 1397 to move up into that big first place spot. And you do have a seven fish limit today, right? Yeah, we had a little bit better day today. Let's find out, guys. What do you say? What do you say? What do you know? Here we go. How about? I like this. This is good. Yeah. Eight fifty-four, guys, for a two-day total of fourteen seventy-five. Fourteen seventy-five. No big fish to weigh. We're gonna get you a weigh-in ticket. Who's gonna be talking sponsors today? All right, well, let's just pass it back and forth. Here you go, Duke. I'm gonna give you this. All right. I want to thank Real Foot and Metal, uh, Scales and Ducktails at Rentals at Real Foot. We want to thank Strike King Lures, the best lures out there. Uh, Lose Poles, to me, it's, it's my favorite pole. And uh, Mr. Crappie. Uh, I think that's it. Good. Well, I want to thank the good Lord for Get it way up in your face there. Thank the good Lord for letting us have all a good, safe tournament. The weather's been beautiful. Boat traffic got a little bit rough today, but um, that's part of it. This summertime, Kentucky Lake. Yes, it is. And, Thank our wives for putting up with us because we are gone awful lot. And when we're home, all we're doing is working on the boat and getting everything ready for the next one. So There you go. But Matt and Angie do a great job. All right, guys. You too. Appreciate it a bunch. Thanks so much for fishing with us. Hope we see you guys at Watch Talk. Thank, Thank you now. All right. Looks like Hudson Pillar and McLeod are still holding on to that 2018 with a 207 big fish. But coming up next, we have our Lucas Oil sponsored team of Drew Morgan and Kent Watson. They had 913 yesterday. They're going to come in today with another seven fish limit. Going to be 1105 out of the lead. You got him, Drew? I don't think we got it. Not quite as good as what we had yesterday. Don't think so? How about you, Digger? What do you think? No, we started off real good. Got a couple um, big fish, bigger than what we caught yesterday, and we struggled with the boat traffic. And um, we had a good time, caught plenty of fish, and we'll see what they work. All right, let's find out, guys. Let's put these guys a scale and see what we got today. You were right. Just a little bit shorter, but not a bad day. 8.53 for a two-day total of 17.66. 17.66. No um, comment? No. Uh, well, let's talk about this. Okay, so you got 17.66. Right now, tentatively, you're running in about 10th spot overall. Valuable points kicking off the 2020 season. Not probably where you want to be, but a good start because you're not starting at the very bottom. You're going to be in a good position starting on that chase. Yeah, um, we're hoping to have a little bit of a better finish next tournament so we can um, stay up there in points for this year and hopefully get a top three in points like <laughs> better than what we did last year. Gotcha. Want to talk about some sponsors? Yeah, I want to thank Luke Soil, B&M Poles. We caught all of our fish on the 16-foot BGJPs and uh, Crappie Magnet. 
and my mom and dad and my grandma and grandpa they all came down here to see me awesome and and cat and cat all right mr kent anything you'd like to add i think about covered everything we've had a great time this week and um you know hey it's gonna be we got a little break before the next one so we're we got some work to do so get um, everything fixed up and rewired and ready to go ready right ready to go there you go. Guys, appreciate it. Congratulations on a great two day. We hope to see you at Watchtaw. All right. Thank you now. Here's your waiting ticket, guys. Sorry about that. There you go. Thank you, Kent. All right, next up we have our Janko Pro Staff sponsor team of John Buckler and Harold Hibbard. Had four fifty eight yesterday, gonna add three to the scale today to add to that total. Welcome to Championship Saturday, guys. Thank How you doing? Just fine. Good. How are you, Harold? Good. All right, let's get you guys scored up here and see where we're at. It was a hot one today, wasn't it? Yep, that it was. Rough. 320 for a two-day total of 778. Anybody you guys like to thank this weekend? Jenko fishing in the bass tank. All right. Just to right to the point, you got it, buddy, right? Yep, that's it. Harold? Well, that's it. That's it. Guys, we appreciate you fishing with us. Hope we see you at Watchtaw, all right? There you go. Oh, there's your weigh-in ticket. Thank you, sir. All right, next up, we've got the team of Richard Hughes and Riley Hughes. Guys, you had a tough day yesterday, didn't you? I'm seeing nothing but circles up there. <laughs> so you got a long road ahead of you. But it looks like we need yeah. 2018 to move into the lead today, but you do have seven fish limit today. Big yeah. improvement. Yeah, it was uh, it was tough, but we dug it out and dug seven today, and it is what it is. Did you have a good time today? Yes, sir. Right on. Let's see what you guys got. Let's get you some points here. Getting to that national championship is always about those points. We only take 100. 851, good day for you guys today. Anybody got to thank this weekend? I just thank Matt and Angie for putting on a great tournament, and my wife for letting me do it. <laughs> All right. Anything you'd like to add? No, sir. No, sir? Got a girlfriend? No. No? You want one? No. But hey, oh, no? Okay. I was going to say we can cut their ass, but you're good? Okay. All right, guys. We sure appreciate it. Here's your weigh-in ticket. Thanks for fishing with us. You guys take care now. All right. Next up, we have Greg Westmoreland and Bobby Westmoreland. They had 307 yesterday. And remember what I told you, right? I said, remember what I said? I said, I expect bigger things out of you. You didn't get it. Didn't get it. No. All right. But we do have four fish today. Yeah. I'll bet you, you did better than 307 though, right? I don't think so. You know, oh, <laughs> let's find out here. No. Well. Oh, it started out that way, but just it fell a little short. 250. 250 for a two-day total of 557. Yep. <laughs> How was your weekend? Hot. Hot. Yeah. But at least it wasn't Kentucky Lake Windy. Have you ever fished this lake before? Yes. So you know what I'm talking about when yes. that wind gets so nasty. So mm -hmm. it was a good weekend, even though it was hot, right? Oh, yeah. All yeah. right. You want to talk about any sponsors or anybody you'd like to thank? Oh, we don't have sponsors. Well, then you thank but yourself. Thank y'all for putting on a good show. There you go. Anything yeah. you'd like to add? I want to thank my wife for putting up with me in the last four days. It's been hot and rough out there. So. Yeah. You guys uh, get along real good? Or you guys argue over where you're going to fish? Uh, she always just go where I go. Really? <laughs> you didn't make any like, secondary suggestions? Say, honey, I think maybe you maybe should have zigged instead of zagged. I did do that, but he... So and he, he said, wasn't nope. happening today. No. Wasn't happening today. So <laughs> no. tonight, tonight he can take all the ownership for your finish. That's right. There you go. Guys, we appreciate you fishing yeah. with us. Hope we see you again, okay? Thanks. Thank you very much. Here's your weighing ticket and grab fish there, okay? Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. All right, next up we have boat number 64. They're the, the everything sponsored team of Stephen Sullivan and Jamie Roberson. 557 yesterday, guys. Follow up with the seven fish limit today. Good to see you guys. How you doing? See, you're doing better. Today. Did you do better today? Had a better day. Good. Let's find out, okay? They look better. Let's see what we got here, guys. Yes, you did do a lot better. How about 769 for a two-day total of 1326? Good valuable points kicking off the season for you. Uh, it's been fun. Uh, you know, Kentucky Lake, you know, everybody loves to be out on the lake on a Saturday afternoon. So, But uh, we had a great time. I want to thank my partner. I mean, he's he got me back safe. That's the most important thing. We had made a long, couple of long runs. <laughs> so. I hear you. Up in Missouri, we call it the churning. They said the lake, she was a churning, I right? Told, I told him that today. I said, she's a churning. Yep, that's right. <laughs> and, you know, I, I, I always talk about, I, always, I want you guys to be really excited and everything, and I forget about, you guys got your rear ends beat up today. <laughs> it's, yes, You're ready did. to get off the stage, aren't yes, you? Yes, we did. <laughs> All right, anybody else you'd like to thank? Yeah, I want to thank our wives for coming up and supporting us. And uh, I want to thank Crappie Depot Outfitters in Batesville, Mississippi. I want to thank uh, Boat Warehouse of the Mid-South, outfitting us for our Ranger boat. And Bean and Poles, we used to be in them stick pretty much exclusively this week. Uh, I want to thank you guys, Jamie and Matt and Angie and everybody with American Copy Trail. This is it's just such a, so much integrity, such a great tournament, so much, uh, so much fun. We really appreciate what y'all do. Thank you. We sure appreciate it. Guys, thanks for fishing with us. Hope to see you at the next one, okay? All right, here's your waiting ticket. 
and fish. Got them? I didn't dump those out, did I? All right. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. All right. Next up on Championship Saturday, we've got the Mr. Crappie Uptel sponsor team of Ronnie Rozier and Matt Rozier. Had 250 yesterday, but I think you guys did a little better today. How you doing? We did a lot better. Did you got four today, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's get you guys on the board, okay? See what we got here. I'm starting to feel it was a little tough out there today. 445 for a two-day total of 695. Guys, 695. Hey, we just want to thank you guys for putting on the tournament. Y'all do a great first-class job. I want to thank Strike King, Luz, Mr. Crappie, and FCI Outdoors, and Team Updale. And happy Father's Day to everybody. It's great to get to fish with your son. Matt, did you miss anything? Uh, he got everything. Uh, Badger Baits, TH Marine, and Cornfield Crop would like to thank you. And the thank you, Dad, for putting up for me because I'm, I'm pretty tough on him. Out Are there you? In the boat. Yeah. Well, lighten up, man. Well, we right. get, no, we you're good. <laughs> you're <laughs> good. <laughs> I hear you. Got you, guys. Well, hey, congratulations on a good finish. We hope we guys see you next one, okay? Appreciate it. All right, Hudson Pillar McLeod, you're still holding on there at that 2018 with a 207 big fish. But next up, we've got Justin Elder and Kenny McAllister, Pico Lure sponsored team. Had 855 yesterday, got a good seven fish limit today. How's Welcome in. Good. Better? Yeah, no, probably not better. I don't know about that. But we caught a lot more fish today. Did you? Yeah, no, we just couldn't find the right one. Numbers, we, but not quality. That's right, but we did catch a lot of fish this week, so it was good times. How'd you catch fish today? We was pulling Pico crankbaits all week, so... Usually when I'm out, that's what we're doing. We're running a new Triton, so we was uh, just out running the new Picos. Gotcha. Not a Pico popper. <laughs> no, not a Pico popper. Oh, so they got it was like, pop, 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 over it. Right. But we got some new colors coming out here real soon as soon as they get in. So if guys that are pulling cranks, we got some really good new crappie catching colors coming. Cool. Let's get your fish weight and see what we got here. On 855 yesterday, we're going to add to it. Boy, you guys almost did it again. 8.05 for a two-day total of 16.60, 16.60. Got your Pico in, but anybody else you want to thank? Yeah, I'd like to thank J.P. Marine back in Evansville. Anybody needs their boat worked on Southern Indiana. J.P. Marine's great guys. Uh, Podunk Ideals and Offshore Tackle. My wife for letting me do this. I'd like to say that she's home making the money, but she figured out when I go, she now she goes to Florida every time I go fishing. So I've been hearing that trend quite a bit here. Yeah, lately. that doesn't even seem fair, does it? <laughs> no, it doesn't. Did he get everything? He did good. We had a great time, met a lot of great people and uh god bless everybody going home there you go be safe appreciate it guys thanks for fishing with us let me get you a ticket here there you go guys thank you much all right next up we have the crappie monster pro staff team of boat 49 grant the excitement jarvis and jason garner had 702 yesterday one short of a limit today grant it's how more, was it it's more of a woo. yes <laughs> you went from yeah to yeah. Woo, take me on yeah, to the house a, all right, you ready to get these out of the way? Yeah. Six, six fish today, guys. On here on Championship Saturday, and we're going to come in at about 5.14 for a two-day total of 12.16. 12.16. It's Kinda points. Like Kentucky Lake. Yeah, it's points. That's why we're up here. That's why go. we would have gone home a long time ago. It was rough today. It was, oh, Lord, it was rough today. <laughs> I know I'm going to buy me a party barge and a daggum jet ski and go on that party. It's in Bennett's Creek down there, because that's where we was, and Lord have mercy, I think everybody and their brother was in there. Was there a point when you said maybe we're in the wrong place today? Well, I mean, it was rolling four-footers in there, and we came out on the river, and it smooth as glass. It's like, <laughs> well, that gum. Like, <laughs> Jason, let's, let's talk about sponsors. Anybody guys like to thank this you weekend? thank Jeremy. Uh, mainly with Crappie Monster. Uh, we put them Crappie Monster baits to work uh, this week. Well, really in practice. We didn't do much in the tournament, but in practice, we had a good practice, but uh, Mark Shelton with Puddle Jump Allures uh, put his jig heads on and uh, caught plenty of fish in practice. I keep saying that mm -hmm. in practice. We're we're gods in practice. Ronnie and Steve and Josh and all, they ain't got a prayer of us in practice. It's the way it always works, but, man. Yeah. <laughs> always works. Jason, anything you'd like to add? Uh, just like to thank uh, Jeremy Mattingly with uh, Crappie Monster, you guys, for putting it on. I like the new rules. I think it legitimizes the, the trail. Um, just going to – I get a break from this guy for a little while, and I guess we'll get after him at Grenada. There you go, guys. We sure Thank appreciate you fishing with us. Thanks Thank much. You we'll see you guys at Grenada, September 11th and 12th. You guys want to fish Grenada? Go to ACT.com. Check it out, AmericanCrappieTrail.com. Coming up next, we have Ron Upchurch and Brandon Upchurch, Mr. Crappie, pro staff sponsored team. Had 593 yesterday. Got five fish today to put them on the scale. How you doing, Brandon? Pretty good. Good. Ron, good? Doing great, great. Let's get you guys on here and see what we did. 
I'm not even going to ask you. It was tough. I've done figured that part out already. <laughs> 408 for a two-day total of 10.01. 10.01. Let's talk about some sponsors over here, Brandon. Let's step over here in the camera. Get on over here. Don't don't be afraid. Huh? Come on in. Come on over. Right. Here you go. I'm going to get in the middle. There we got it. All right. Now we got it. Let's go. Hey, well, first off, we'd thank, like to thank God, first and foremost, to give us uh, the ability to come out here and, and uh, enjoy this uh, with American Crappie Trail. Thank you all as well. Uh, Mr. Croppy, uh, Wally Marshall, we'd like to thank uh, Lou, Strike King, um, <laughs> Ranger Boats, a lot of, lot of sponsors. Southside Auto Parts in Greenwood was our uh, title sponsor for this deal, so we thank them. And uh, Uptail, our primary sponsor, and uh, Pro Team Guys out of Grenada, Mississippi. Did he miss anything? I think that's pretty good. Guys, we sure appreciate you thank fishing you with us. Thanks for letting me go home. How about that? They said, thanks for letting us go home. I'll let you go now, okay? Appreciate it. That would you grab your fish here, sir. There you go. I'll get you that. Here's your waiting ticket. I'll get you that one. Thank you now. All right, next up, we got a Crappie Monster Pro Staff sponsor team of Michael Pelser and Wendell Heath. Had 644 yesterday. Another another ride on the struggle bus today, Mike. How you doing? Ah, uh, we've had better days, but we got to fish, so that's all that matters. I know, I'm still jealous. How you doing, Wendell? Oh, we're doing all right. Right on. Let's get these four on the scale, okay? Let's get you towards that national championship. You've made them all so far, haven't you? Yes, sir. That's what I thought. 352 for a two-day total of 996, guys. 996. Who'd you guys like to thank this weekend? Um, Crappie Monsters, Jeremy Mattingly, um, the Outlaw Net. Uh, I'd like to thank God, first and foremost, for uh, allowing this beautiful scenery and uh, the beautiful weather and everything else. Um, I would also like to thank... Uh, uh, police officers out there. If anybody out there knows a police officer, I'd like to say thank you to police officers, state troopers, county sheriffs, game wardens, you name it. I, they all they all protect and save us. So that's all I got to thank. I still haven't got him trained to thank my wife while, while he's up here. Uh, no, I know. I'd like to thank my Speaking wife, between American here. Crappie Trail. If you all are wanting to fish a tournament, I'm telling you, this is the best the best in the world. I mean, it's the best. Um, I'd like to thank Jeremy Mattingly with Crappie Monster. Um, we used a lot of his baits this week. Um, unfortunately, we couldn't get them in the boat today with them. So. It happens. It happens. <laughs> it happens. <laughs> this isn't a game of inches. It's a game of hundreds of ounces, so yep. it happens. Guys, we sure appreciate it. First class, guys. Thanks. See you at Watchita. See you at Watchita. Thank you now. All right, moving on here. We're getting closer and closer to that top ten. Have this little shootout. But next we're going to bring up the O'Reilly sponsored team of Charlie Fitzgerald and Dwayne Elliott. Had seven pounds even on the money yesterday. Today a little short, guys. Three yes, fish. Sir. Yes, sir. It was tough today. Of course, it was tough all week. You know, we broke uh, transducers, trolling motor. We were on the road getting boat fixed more than we was fishing. But uh, anyway, we had a good time, you know, so. Uh, I li I really like to thank O'Reilly's and uh, Matt with uh, High Tech Outdoors. If y'all have any problems with your grass trolling motor, that man, let me tell you, he knows what he's doing. He is probably the best I've ever seen. He he he'll be the only one that touched my boat from now on. There you I go. <laughs> right on. Let's get your three fish on the scale here. Get you some valuable points. Get you to the national championship, and let's uh, get you to fixing the rest of your stuff. Right. 391 for a two-day total of 1091, guys. 1091. Dwayne, did he miss anything? Uh, Lucas Oil, American Crappie Trail, uh, Drift Masters. There you go, guys. We appreciate it a bunch. Looking forward to seeing you at Watchtaw. All right. Yes, sir. All right. Thanks, guys. All right, we're ready for another group of fish, and we're gonna have coming up next our Mr. Crappie Strike King Pro Staff team of Mark Williams and Trent Jones. Had 960 yesterday, guys. 960, and you're going to have, going to need 1058 to move into the lead today. Seven fish today live. How you doing, Mark? Doing good, man. Doing good. good. You, did you guys do better? I would think we did. Our scales broke out on us. So All right. Well, you know, I got, guess. I got good news. Scales, so. Hey, you got good scales. I got good scales. We'll see. Uh, <laughs> we're going to find out. You want to guess at it? Uh, I'm saying a little better than yesterday, maybe 975. All right. Well, let's see, okay? Let's find out. I'm gonna say He's, He's going to say 10. 10. They feel heavy, guys. Here we go. This is the most excitement I've had so far. You did break the 10-pound barrier. She's calming down, though. There we go. 10.06, guys. Great day. Two-day total, 19.66. That's good enough to put you in second place right now. That's great. I know, right? Hey. And I see there's still a little bit of a line, but not a big oh, yeah. line. Yeah, that's a big line. Nah, there's still nah. 10 and a few after that, but hey, good day. 
Hey, I'd like to thank Cypress Creek Outdoors in Dyersburg, Tennessee for one of my sponsors. This your home lake? Yes, sir. All right. Now that explains a little bit more now, doesn't it? Yeah. You brought you in a ringer, didn't you? No. No, just, okay. I'm sorry. fish together all the time. All right. I was just checking. Just it's checking. Not here. Just not here. I it's got not you. Not here. Uh, <laughs> no, I've been up here a couple times this year. But I'd like to thank good Lord above, most of all, my wife putting up with me and uh, all my sponsors, Strike King, Mr. Crappy, Lou's really good to us. Tough fishing today, slow bite. We had to sit on one bed for 45 minutes, but we seen three big fish in there, and we got two of them. There you go. That's what counts, right? Yeah. We, I think we throwed everything we had at them, and finally they give it up. <laughs> Did he miss yeah. anything? No. Nah. I'd like to thank my wife and my little boy, Jace. My wife's name's April. They're at home right now. There you go. Letting me fish. Awesome. Awesome. Get home and get to celebrate a little Father's Day tomorrow. Yes, sir. All right, guys. Ready. I appreciate it a bunch. Hope to see you guys at Watchtower, right? Thank you much. And I was just kidding about the ringer thing. <laughs> You're good everywhere you go. All right, next up, they were boat number one. They are Philip Williams and Brian Wright. They had 791 yesterday. They are coming today with a seven fish limit. Going to need 1227 to move into the lead today, guys. Right. You think you got him? <laughs> Not even He close. said it was going to be about right, right? <laughs> I wish. Oh, I wish. Gotcha. <laughs> Let's see what we got, guys. Let's put you on the scale here. Went downhill a little bit today, but I've never been so proud to have seven fish. I hear you. Six ninety-one. Man, I was exactly one pound short of yesterday. Two-day total fourteen eighty-two. Fourteen eighty-two. Any guys like to thank this weekend? Uh, yeah, we still want to thank the good Lord up above, the wife, and uh, also want to thank Abernathy Marine. I know there's been a lot of controversy around that area, and some things happened that should not have happened. But we still need to support the employees and people that work there and, and still give them our business and, and um, kind of get everything back on track and go from there. Uh, what do they say? We're all in this together and we'll all work through it? That's right. There you go. Exactly. Anything you'd like to add, sir? Yeah, just had a great time. Didn't catch the quality fish we wanted, but we really appreciate y'all for putting on a quality tournament. And we'll be back. I always say the only quality tournament is unless you have quality fishermen. That's and exactly we right. And we sure appreciate you guys fishing with us. Thanks so much. All right. Here's your waiting ticket, sir. Thanks. And we appreciate it. Hope to see you at Wachita. All right, next up. We have got boat number 31. They are Brad Essery and Mike Johnson. They had 871 yesterday. They've got a seven fish limit today. They're going to need 1147 to move into the lead. And Brad, do you got 1147? We do not have 1147, but we got better than what we did yesterday. We saved our best spot for today, and it, it was definitely the best spot. Well, it's either going to get you a check or some good points, one or the other, right? I hope so. All right, let's find out. What do you say? You ready, Mike? I'm ready. All right. That's why I'm. You feel pretty good, Brad. I don't think you weren't kidding. You did better yourself by quite a bit. Going to be 956 for a two-day total of 1827. 1827 right now will put you guys unofficially in ninth spot right now. Cool beans, man. I would like to uh, – I want to thank our sponsors, too. Strike King, Mr. Crappie, Lou's Poles. I want to thank my wife uh, for putting up with me and letting me spend so much time on the water. I want to thank Tommy Williams for showing up for a weigh-in finally. Uh, but uh, a lot of good guys. I will tell you this, guys. Our lake's getting better. I live l less than a mile from this ramp, and uh, we still have a carp problem on this lake, but things are getting better. We had a great, great spring. Uh, unfortunately, if you wasn't here to get part of it, I'd tell you to come back next year and get you some because they're here. You know, big guys step on toes. They kind of hurt. Absolutely. I just well, I, 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 if you noticed that I was kind of I was like yeah. <laughs> anyway, did you miss anything, Mike? I think he got it all. I just want to thank you guys for putting on a, a great tournament, and uh, we've had a great time. We'll be back. Very good, guys. Hey, we sure appreciate you fishing with us. Hope we see you at Watchtower. All right. Thanks, guys. Thank appreciate you. it. Grab a fish there, and we'll get her going. All right. Next up, we've got Minn Kota Hummingbird Pro Staff sponsor team of Joe and Jeanette Carter. They had five seventy two yesterday. You guys are only fourteen forty six out of the lead. And you got one fish short of a limit today, guys. Welcome up to Championship Saturday. Come on over and see me. How you doing? Pretty good. All good to see you, Joe. All six alive. All six alive. Jeanette. Hello. Did you let the big one get away? Uh, yeah. All yeah. right. That, that's, that's what happened. So if that's what happened, I'll just take it. it. All right. Let's get these six on. Let's get you some championship points. How about that? Did better, though. 589 for a two-day total of 1161. 1161 for Kentucky Lake. Good fishing. Oh, it's excellent fishing here. We just suck. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, so we've determined your fishing skills now by your, by your account, so let's talk about sponsors. Well, uh, Fusion, let her talk about them. Oh, let's move over. Fusion custom, here we go. Fusion Custom Apparel. Don't get away from me. Get back here in the camera. You can't walk away. Ah. I'm going to have to pull you in. All right. All right. Fusion Custom Apparel jerseys make wonderful jerseys. Um, 
uh, Jiffy Jigs out of Vidalia, Georgia, family-owned business. They have wonderful products. They have really great hair jigs, and they have uh, all kinds of jigs, obviously, but particularly fond of their hair jigs. Um, who else, Joe Carter? Yamaha. We're proud of our Yamaha boat, a motor, rather, and our Ranger boat. Um, and we thank God and country. There you we're go. We're proud to be Americans, as y'all well know, and we're happy to be here, and we thank you guys. I want to tell you, I always have a smile on face every time I see you guys blast off, always smiling, cheering, <laughs> having a great time. So thank you for the excitement and appreciate you guys fishing with us. And we're going to see you again, right? Yep, definitely. All right, very good. Uh, we're not trying to. There's your way in ticket. Guys, appreciate it a bunch. Take care. Be careful going home. All right, next up, he was flying solo yesterday, but put together a good string of 863. He's got another seven fish limit today. We're going to bring up boat number 13, Brent Smith. Man, I almost matched you today. I was trying. I, watch your toe there. That thing's sharp, isn't it? Man, when you barefooted it is. I know. I put flip flops on. You see, I was trying to match up there with you with our hook gear. Help me out. Do you call it hook or huck? Hook. Hook. All right, it's hook. I was just making sure I hear it from everybody, so now I just want to get the right one. I can't give you no excuses after that sass yesterday. Now. Did I give you sass? A little sass. A little I sass. think I've, I don't, I've slept since. I don't remember that. A little sass. You said I lost two last time. You did lose two last, but so you got seven what? today. I lost two this time, but I made up for it. There you go. Let's see what we got here, buddy. Is it good? They feel good. You did really good today. How about this? 977 for a two-day total of 1840. That's whooping it by yourself. Man, I, Get it real close to the area. I, I miss having a partner in there with a net. After losing four fish just in this tournament at the surface, it makes it really hard. But these are some heck of some competitors. I enjoy fishing against everybody here. Really good people. I want to thank Angie and Matt for doing what they do for us. Thank my wife for letting me fish. Thank God for giving us all the health to be here and to make it through a June tournament safe as we were. Um, and outside of that, thank you, man. I forgot to weigh your big fish. Yeah, you need to weigh Let's that. Let's weigh that guy. Let's see what we got here. Big fish broke the two-pound barrier earlier. Let's see what we got here. I think it would have. It's just sick on this lake. Now here, that's a nice fish, though. Let me find my bag. All right, here we go. Big fish. That's a good one. 179, 179. I'm going to take that microphone. I want you to grab that guy and hold him up there and show about what that fish looks like there. Did we get all our thank yous out of the way? Yes, sir. Here's your weigh-in ticket. I'm going to get you, you an update. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Sorry about the sass. I'll correct myself next time, okay? Taking this one or that? You have them both. Oh, okay. All right. Thank you, sir. All right. Next up on the stage, we've got boat number 23. They are the team of Jimmy Ayers and Mike Kleinard. Had 831 yesterday. Got another seven fish limit today. Going to need 1187 to move into that oh-so-hot spot in number one. You got them? No, we ain't got them. No. Don't got them. How you doing, Jimmy? I'm doing great, buddy. How are you? Good. Tough day, he says. Let's find out. What do you say? Jimmy, to the scale we go, guys, we're going to have... 797 for a two day total of 1628. 1628. Pretty good day. Yeah, it's good. Uh, we had to get one out of every creek up through there, so it was a tough day. And I'd like to thank uh, Adams Gas, BM Poles, and I got to say hi to my grandkids because they always get mad at me when I leave these terms. They say, Why don't you say hi to us, Poppy? So I want to say hi to all my grandkids. I got five of them. And just thank y'all for the good job that y'all do and the hard work y'all do. Thanks. I appreciate that. Jimmy? All right. Thank you, buddy. I just want to thank B&M Poles. We, uh, we did a little something different than most people. We spider rig, BGJP 16-footers, and uh, we caught a lot of fish with them down here. So I uh, really thank him and uh, thank my family. They're all here this weekend. So uh, thank God for a beautiful week. There you go. Guys, we sure appreciate fishing again. Great to thank see you again on the 2020 season. You, Hope to see you at the next one. Here's your ticket, sir. Thank you now. All right, next up, we've got boat number 28, the team of Marvin Yagel and Jeff Duncan. Had a tough, tough day yesterday. Had 187. Got six today, though, guys. I'm not going to tell you you need 1831 to move into the lead. but You don't have, you don't have to tell me that. <laughs> all right, but we're going to better ourselves today, right? Yeah, a lot get, better. Let's get some points, guys. What do you say? Did a lot better today. 471 for a two-day total of 633, guys. 633. Who would you like to thank this weekend for being here? Well, uh, I'd like to thank my brother here for making it with me. Younger yeah, brother? Yeah. yeah. It was right. a tough day today and yesterday, and he's, he's feeling all right, but he's ready to go home. Yeah? <laughs> Did he put the whooping on you and wear you out? Yeah, man, it's tough out there. <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of boats out there. You know, from a guy from Lake of the Ozarks, I keep forgetting because we always go to these smaller lakes, we get to one of these recreational lakes, and it yeah. plays a big factor in your fishing. Yeah, those boats, man, they like to capsize us. <laughs> Pontoon, big yachts. We stayed out there with them, though. 
There you go. Still caught some fish, though. Get it all covered? Yeah, I think so. Uh, From Monroe to here, I, I'm, I'm proud of him. Good. <laughs> We're going to see you guys at Monroe next time around? Uh, probably so. Hope you, so. You, you coming up that way? Yeah, we're going to be at Wachita. So, are you at Wong Monroe? Monroe, Indiana. Lake Monroe. I was thinking Monroe, Louisiana. But yeah. I'll get it. There's a lot, you know, in the spirit of things, there's a whole bunch of Monroes, so we'll get it's it figured not out. Louisiana, but All right. Maybe. All right. Well, guys, appreciate you fishing with us. Thank you so much. Let me get your weigh in ticket here. There you are, sir. Thank you now. All right. Next up, we got boat number 25. Marty Snyder and Jackie Alvin had 864 yesterday, got seven fish today alive. Welcome to Championship Saturday. Tough day. You're not going to move into that top 10 again this week? Not this time. Don't think so? Well, let's find out, guys. I'm kind of used to seeing you up there, though, you know? What's it going to be like without you this time? Good day, though. Downhill. 767 for a two-day total of 1631. Good points and a good place to be in kicking off the 2020 season for you. Anybody you guys like to thank this weekend? Yeah, just my kids at home and... Uh Huckabee Rods. Uh, Let's get that up there so they can hear you. Sorry, it's a bad mic. Huckabee Rods, and uh, that's about it. All right. Did he miss anything? I uh, thank you guys. American Crop Tail. We're going to fish all the rest of them this year. And uh, I'd like to say hi to my grandkids, Lily, Bodie, and Marley. There you go. Guys, we sure appreciate it. And I know we're going to be on the hunt to get them at Watchtaw, so we'll see you there. Okay, guys? Appreciate it a bunch. All right, next up, we have our Jenko Fishing Pro Staff team of Bill Thornburg and Rick Moody. Had 836 yesterday. Going to need 1182 to move into the lead today. Seven fish limit today. How was it? It's rough. Rough, but yeah. better or worse? We won't have 11. Won't have 11? No, we got seven. Got seven, but hopefully a seven will go for. <laughs> seven. A seven for seven? Let's see here, guys. Let's get you on the board and find out. Well, you're pretty close. 736. Added to your 836 is 1572 two day total. We'll Good weekend for we'll you guys. Take it. Yep. Uh, we'd like to thank Jinko and, and uh, Tony Shepard, them, ACT. And I'm glad Matt let you start picking the weather. You did a good job. Thank you. I tried. <laughs> they were good calling job. for some rain. I was a little scared, but it blew it by, so out, we got though. lucky. It yeah, out. yeah. We appreciate it, though. Yeah, I didn't pick anything. Did he miss anything, Rick? Uh, th thank our wives for letting us come. Big T, meat getter jigs, and uh, I guess that's it. That'll that's work. it? Work. All right, guys, well, I'm going to give you a weigh-in ticket. I'm going to say thank you and hope to see you guys at Watchtower, all right? Appreciate it now. All right, folks, we're getting closer and closer to that top ten. Next up, we've got Randy Brees and Blake Williams. They had 942 yesterday. Had a good day yesterday. Got another good seven today, guys? It's decent. It's not as good as it was yesterday, but all right. it was a tough day. It seems like it was tough for everyone yes, today. Yes, no doubt. All right, you ready? We're ready. All right, let's find out, guys. They do feel pretty good, guys. Let's see what we got here. You did catch them good today. How about eight ninety five for a two-day total of 1837 Guys, 1837 will put you in about ninth place unofficially right now. That's good. We'll take that. I know. I know this line's getting a little bit shorter. Our top ten getting ready to come, so maybe yeah. we can find yourself your way into a check line. Yeah, probably not, but we'll, we'll, we'll hope for it. All right. Anybody you guys like to thank this weekend? I'd like to thank the good Lord, uh, my wife, um, Blake, for fishing with me, and uh, I'd like to say happy Father's Day to my father. There you go. So. Blake, any missing anything? Anything you'd like to add? I uh, just thank the good Lord for letting this happen and my wife for putting up with me and yeah. Randy for putting up with me. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I sure appreciate it. Thanks for putting up with me. Thanks. Here's your weigh-in ticket, and we sure appreciate, appreciate you fishing with us. We'll hope we see you at Wachita. All right, next up we have the Maintenance Matters team of Dan Danamuler and Sue Danamuler. They're boat number 11. Had 5'11 yesterday. Got a seven fish limit today. Guys, welcome to Championship Saturday. How you doing, Dan? Thank you, Brian. We're doing good. We're just a little overheated. I hear you, Sue. How you doing? I'm great. Seven fish today. Are they better today? Uh, I don't think. About the same. About the same? Let's see Oh, here. no, it's a little better. You did better yourself. 557 for a two-day total of 1068. Good points to kick off the 2020 season for you guys. That is. We'll take that. Uh, especially, we had a tough practice week this week. We couldn't get on big fish. We'd catch a big one here and one there, and we'd run, 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 run. And so we just never got a consistency. So we went for numbers. We caught numbers this week, but we didn't catch quality. So we caught a lot of keepers. We caught 10 today and like uh, 20 fish yesterday. So, But that's okay. We did all right. You know, it was just a little warm. Would like to thank you guys for a great tournament here on Kentucky Lake. Also Yamaha Outboards, Ranger Boats as well as B&M Poles, Bobby Garland, uh, Power Pole, Garmin, all the guys that make it happen for us. 
Go ahead, Sue. Ga- gamma fishing. Gamma fishing. Oh, and tackle webs. we got to tell about tackle webs also. Offshore boards. We pulled offshore boards this week. We pulled cranks. We pulled them today. We had pushed. Uh, I'm going to tell you right now, they're moving to all the wood right now. They're all going to the wood. So I want to thank you guys. We had a great tournament here, and thanks to uh, all the hospitality in the area. It was great, and thanks, American Crappie Trail. Thank you, guys. We sure appreciate it. Hope we see you at the next one, okay? We, thanks, we, guys. We. Says they'll be there. So here's your weigh-in ticket. I'll grab your fish there. Thank you, guys. Have a great week. Be safe going home. All right, next up, we've got the team of boat number 20, Philip Haynes and Andrew Pauling. Had 884 yesterday. Got a couple fish short of a limit today, five fish today. But are they good enough to make 1134 to move it to the lead? If you multiply it by two, they will. All right, whose fault was it today? Mine. Boat fail? No, no. I spent too long looking at live scope trying to make fish show up. Making them show up. Make them show up. We ran a long ways, got there, and... We just thought, ah, they'll, they'll show up. They'll show up. 574 today, guys. That's going to put you at 574. Get you tallied up here. Two-day total of 1458, 14. sir. 1458. Right now, unofficially, it'll put you in about... Way at the bottom. 25th. Yeah. That's, that's a I good figured. place to be kicking off for the point season if you're yeah, going to do some more with us. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's all right. I mean, we just made mistakes. We've had fish, you know, 60 miles from the la- launch, and I gambled, and... It worked yesterday. It didn't work out today. They wasn't there, and we just took all day to catch what we had. Well, you know what they say. Uh, they always say, go big or go home, and I hate to tell you it's time for you to go home. But that that is absolutely correct. I swung for the fence and missed today. That's right. Andrew, is, he, is he, was anybody you'd like to thank or anybody you'd like uh, to talk to? Or? I just want to thank my wife for letting me be here. That's it. You know, She takes care of my uh, kids and my farm while I'm gone, so that's about it. Gotcha. Absolutely. Definitely my wife. Uh, this is the first time she, since we've had our daughter that she's covered for me for a whole week so I could get away and fish. I know I'm probably going to get griped at a little bit, but but uh, all in all, I'm really happy that uh, that I got to get away and come down and, and see what ACT was all about. Uh, it Awesome. Completely cool, awesome. Cool. Did you, uh, did you take time off? I did. I had to take the whole week off. Let's, let's, let's give them a little howdy doody there. Huh? Oh, yeah. yeah. St- Stover Milling <laughs> Company. Yep. A uh, little vacation time. We like to appreciate that. Um, but no, it, it's been great. You know, uh, finally getting getting to, you know, to where I can get back and, and fish a little bit. Uh, today or this this whole week, you know, of course, we were here the whole week uh, enjoying the town and stuff, but probably six, seven hundred miles put on the boat. Uh, so we definitely <laughs> bought plenty of gas from around here. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Philip says he needs a fuel sponsor. Do you hear that yeah, in the background? That's gotcha. what we need. That's what we need. But well, I'll tell you what, for everybody that's watching online, I'll tell you what, I've seen these guys fish for many, many years. You guys have been away from each other for a little bit. If you fish another one, guys, I'm going to tell you right now, watch out. These guys are going to knock the rust off. We're going to get them, You're right? Appreciate it, guys. Thanks for fishing with us. Good to see you. Got them? All right. All right, next up on the stage, we've got boat number 24, Garrett Steele, the Yamaha Pro Staff sponsor team. Had a buck 70 yesterday. Yeah. Tough day. Unbelievable. T- tough week all around for me, both pre fish and didn't turn around in the tournament, unfortunately. So, you know, one of those things. Caught two fish today, both died. I caught them this morning and not really deep hooked. You know, I'm pretty good at keeping fish alive. Don't know what happened, but just one of those weeks for me. But anyway, you know, it's always great to be able to get out and, uh, and fish, and uh, I'm still going to put on a lot of miles between now and the end of the year. Got a lot of people to thank. Uh, Yamaha Outboards, thank you so much. So proud to be part of Yamaha Pro Fishing. Also part of the conservation effort, uh, Let America Fish. You guys should go to letamericafish.org and be a part of protecting our right uh, to fish and protecting our waters. Zip fire starters, Outdoors First Media. Two new sponsors coming on this, uh, this year. I want to thank already Abu Garcia and Berkeley Fishing, so proud to have them on, and I guess uh, we'll, uh, we can only go up from here. That's right, well, let's get this guy away here. We got another one today to add to the one yesterday. He's gonna be a 136 for a two-day total of 281. Garrett, uh, one, oh, got one more? One more thing, well, th- thank American Crappie Trail. Uh, for you, those of you out there watching, top level, top notch. If you haven't fished it yet, you're missing out. You need to get out here and fish ACT. Also, my manager was able to be here with me and not always is she able to. Appreciate Tina Marie for everything, music and uh, fishing. She makes it happen. Very thanks good. Y'all. Garrett, thanks so much. Appreciate you fishing with us. And with that, that closes out our first little section of the weigh-in. We're going to take a quick commercial break. The top 10's coming for that shootout. Stick around, folks. It's going to get exciting. For every hour I spend fishing, I spend countless hours off the water managing tackle, taking care of my truck and boat. Sometimes I'm on the road for six weeks straight. 
With Lucas Oil Products, I know my truck is always ready so I can stay on the road and focus on the water. Lucas Oil, made in America, sold to the world. Getting a high quality, American made product at one of the best price points in the industry. Customer service that's second to none. More importantly, they flat out catch fish. Launching a Ranger aluminum boat that's cut full of holes may sound a little crazy, but with so much closed cell foam inside, it's easy to see the added safety and stability. It's a huge confidence booster, especially with so much quality inside, along with Evernew Detex unrivaled performance and 300 hours with no dealer scheduled maintenance. Ranger aluminum is built to excel and priced to be yours. Power your Ranger with Evernew Detex. B&M Poles, the number one crappie pole company in the world. More tournament wins than any other crappie pole. B&M Poles.com. And we're back, folks, right here at Kentucky Lake, a beautiful Paris landing right here in Tennessee. Folks, it's the American Crappie Trail Championship Saturday, brought to you by Super Clean. We're getting ready to find out who our next champion is going to be, but right here to my right, on your screen would be probably to your left, I've got Jason Hodson Pillar and Adam McLeod. And guys, you came through with an outstanding strength today, 2018 with a 207 kicker. Man, you got to be feeling good right now. Feeling really good. After the day we had yesterday, we got through the day with nothing breaking down and was able to put some good fish in the boat. It, it was a much more fun today fishing than yesterday. How many top tens you guys had so far this year? Uh, none this year. So you're the first time in the hot Well, that's our first term of the year, so welcome to the first, yeah. first leader in the hot seat, guys. <laughs> Congratulations. Let's don't waste any time. Let's see how long you guys can stay here. Maybe we'll see at the very end. You ready? Yes, All right, so here's what we got. We're going to bring up our 10th place finisher yesterday. They had 983 yesterday. They are the Janko Fishing Pro Staff team of Chris Bouchard and Jay Barres. Seven fish alive to the scale today. Welcome to Championship Saturday. Top 10. Congratulations. How you doing? Thank you, baby. I'm doing good. Good. Jay, you good? Doing good. We're going to go for it here. 1035 to move into the lead. You ready? Uh, yeah, I'm ready. Look, I'm excited too, guys. You all ready to find out who's going to move on? It's going to be... You're going to be short today, guys. Yeah, 909 for a two-day total of 1892. Guys, 1892 unofficially puts you in fifth spot right now. Not too bad. Um, just we beat our stuff up for two days in a row. Uh, other than that, we had a pretty good day. We caught a lot of fish. I'd like to thank Jinko, all of our family. Rooster's birthday's next week. Happy birthday, Rooster. That's my little girl. Um, vicious Fishing Line, <coughs> Big T Jigs, um, ACT, and Paris and Henry County Chamber of Commerce for having us up here. Um, other than that, it's been a great day. I want to thank our wives for letting us come up here. And uh, we had a big time. Look forward to the next one. Very good. Conditions get tough for you? I mean, did, did you do everything you had? Did you miss a fish? No, we didn't miss it. We lost. We lost, I hate to say it, and it wasn't really our fault. We caught them a little bit deeper. We lost five fish. That would have helped us a few tents. But other than that, I mean, now we fished clean, caught a lot of fish. Boat traffic got to us a little bit. We probably should have run, but we've been catching them in two bays, and we stayed there the last two days and just beat her down. We burn it to the ground. Gotcha. Guys, congratulations. A great top ten. We sure appreciate Thank it. You, Thank you, Jay. And just like that, gentlemen, you stuck around for another day. Yeah. Yeah, one more. Okay, I, I want – they got a lot of people out here, and they're watching. A lot of people be watching online here in just a little bit. Tell me what's way down deep in your stomach right now. How are you feeling? We ain't going to be up here much longer. You don't think? No. But you kind of hope, right? Oh, I hope. It's like deep down, don't you go, and I hope he knocked you off with a net here in a little bit, right? Yeah. No, yesterday killed us. 
All right, you ready, bud? Oh yeah. All right, let's let's know. do it, guys. All right, next up, he was ninth yesterday. He is boat number ten. Had nine eighty six yesterday. Going to need ten thirty two to move into the hot spot. Bass Tank Pro Staff Team. John Sukup, welcome to Championship Saturday, sir. Thank you. Seven fish alive. Good to go. Yes. Got them? No. No. The excitement <laughs> is gone. We got, we got a little bit less than yesterday. All right, let's see what we got here, John. Did it by himself. Congratulations on a great top 10 for starters. You're right, just a hair short. 881 for a two-day total of 1867. Buddy, let me tell you something. You knocked it out of the park fishing alone in this kind of weather. Yeah, you know, uh, I have to thank the bass tank. Have to, right? Right. But, uh, no, really, the guy's, the guy's back working at the shop, checking on the phones, allowing Zeke to go fish the Crappie Masters this week, and I'm here at the ACT. Uh, I want to thank Scott, Darren, DeForest, Ken, all you guys, thank you guys for holding down the fort and letting us do this. Uh, my wife, kids, they're missing me. I'm missing them. Uh, I, love, I love this crappie environment. I love this ACT group. Thank you guys for putting this on. I love the live release trailer. I know we try to do everything we do to keep them alive. Hope that that's something that continues to go in the sport. So, thank you. That's it? That's it. Hey, congratulations. Great top 10, John. Good job doing it by yourself. Here we get your weigh-in ticket. Here you go, John. I'll give you these and I'll get your fish, okay? Thank you very much. Appreciate it. And boom. How many's left? Still in there. Got eight of them. All right. Just making sure you're counting. You good? Jason? I got some good ones. Feel right some nerves? I see, oh, yeah. I All see right. some good ones, though. All right. We good go? All right. Let's move on. Seventh place finishers yesterday. Had 990 yesterday. Got seven fish alive today. Chase Petty and Braxton Tucker. How you doing, guys? Doing good. Good? You got that? Yeah. Uh, but, no, we don't have it. No, we don't have it. <laughs> you know, it's my job here to put some drama out there. Maybe, maybe you're, you're wrong. Maybe gonna, your scales are off. You're not going to. Well, you're not going to get that from us. All right, let's find out. Okay, yeah. you ready, Go bud? Ahead. All right, let's do it. To the scale here. Does he do it? He needs ten twenty. Uh, you know what? That thing locks so quick. Ten seventy two. You did do it. How about that? Mm. Well. Twenty sixty two. You're our new leader. It's pretty I'll tough. Yeah. Huh? We, we, we I told you your off, skills might have been uh, way off. <laughs> man, that's, 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 that's crazy. You, know? you got a big fish you want to weigh in there? No. no. Yeah, that's a solid string no. fish, guys. That's uh, really we, good. We took some chances, and looks like it paid off. But anybody that knows us this week, uh, we ran and ran and ran. Uh, we burned a lot of gas. We took a chance this morning, went way down south, and uh, it's been hot. How did you find your fish? Uh, we've been here a time or two. All right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's about all you're going to get out of me. All right. Well, listen, are you excited at all? Yeah, I reckon. Reckon? No. I, re I mean, I don't say much, so. Well, I'll tell you, let me tell you this. Go ahead. Now, I will say, I, I want to thank, I want to thank a few people. Um, we, we only lost one fish yesterday, and it's because of Icy Tech coolers. And I'm a firm believer, if you have the right cooler, oxygen, we on, we lost one fish yesterday. We caught it, and uh, yeah, it was it wasn't. I laid it in my hand, and it wasn't going to make it in my hand. I told him it was going to die right there. So that's the only thing we lost all week. And I know people have been fighting, and fighting and fighting, keeping fish alive. But man, we we haven't had any trouble. I mean, I'm looking out, and I'm fishing against my heroes. I caps and and blackly. I mean, it, I can't even believe I'm up here doing this. It's a lot of work. Well, a lot I got, of work, a lot of years. I got some good news for you. Yeah. It's time for you to take the Millennium Hot Seat. I'm You're ready. our new leaders, guys. I'm ready. Congratulations. Thank appreciate you. it. All right, guys. Appreciate it. Adam, Jason, congratulations on a great top ten. Way to hold it on as long as you did. All right. Let me take these fish over for you real quick. Set these guys right there. We're going to move on here to Championship Saturday. Got a new set of leaders, new set of weights. Coming up next, they are the B&M Crappie Magnet Pro Staff Sponsored Team of Chris Mann and Terry Mann. Had 9.99 yesterday, guys. Got seven fish alive. Going to need 10.63 to move into that seat today. How are you doing today? Uh, doing well, Jamie. Doing Don't well. say yes or no if you got it or not. We're just going to find out, okay? Okay, let's find out. All right. How are you feeling? I'm uh, feeling well. Did uh, you do well today? I think we fell off a little today compared to yesterday, but we'll see what we did. So. All right. You guys ready to find out let's do it okay gonna need 1063 guys let's see what we got here gonna be a hair short guys 869 869 for a two-day total of 1868 but an outstanding two-day total for you guys congratulations well thank you we were blessed um got a lot of folks who want to thank uh, definitely crappie magnet jeff smith just treats us like gold uh, great company 
Um, if you guys haven't tried those lures, try them out. Uh, B&M poles, uh, they treat us excellent. We love being B&M pro staffers. Uh, dream of ours come true a couple years ago, and uh, uh, just, just a great bunch of folks. We're blessed. Uh, we want to say thank you to a couple of fellow competitors, Chris Bushart. Um, the other day I had a little problems out here uh, with my truck, and he was more than willing to, to help. John Sokup, same for him. Uh, and yesterday, Steve Ferguson and Frank Finley, uh, they actually gave us some oxygen, an oxygen tank. I uh, wouldn't take any money for it. Uh, we ran out of oxygen yesterday, and uh, we weren't able to get some place to get more because of the meeting afterwards yesterday. So they ha hooked us up. So guys, thank you all, top-notch fellas. Uh, what more could you ask for? Competitors that will help you out on the water. Uh, so the fishing great. family. Fishing family. Yes. Terry, did you miss anything? Uh, he, he pretty much got it all. I'd all like right. to thank his mom, who happens to be my wife. And <laughs> for 50 years, we've been married, and she puts up with this, so it makes you wonder. <laughs> no, what, don't. What, what's she thinking, right? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, congratulations on our top 10 kicking off the 2020 season. We sure appreciate hey, I it. I do want to say um, my fiance Kayla, this past week, I proposed after several years, and uh, so I just want to say, th hey, thanks to her and all the support she gives me in this. Congratulations on everything. And congratulations on upcoming nuptials, buddy. Appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it a bunch. Here's your weigh-in ticket, guys. Here you go. All right, we're getting down to it, guys. You feeling confident? No, you got some good fishers behind us. I'm looking. I, I'm literally looking behind us, and just look at the guys coming up. I don't think it's going to hold up, but I'm enjoying being here. Yeah, you enjoy that seat for a little bit. We'll see if it sticks around, okay? Coming up next on Championship Saturdays, a couple of heavy hitters been up here before. Boat number 55, Thatcher Waymeyer and Buster Braun had 10.04 yesterday. Going to come back again today for make a run at it with a seven fish limit alive. Need 10.58 to move into the lead. Thatch, what do you think? Oh, not a whole lot. Um, we had a lot of fun today. Uh, we want to thank everybody for coming out. We'll see what we weigh. Let's see what we weigh. You ready, Buzz? Yep. All right, let's do it. You guys got them today? Uh, all right, let's see what we got here. Gonna fall off the stale there. Yep, a little short, guys, but got real close. 925 for a two day total of 1929. Great two day total for you guys. Congratulations on yet another top 10 finish. Thanks, Jamie. Uh, I'd like to thank ACT, um, Buzz, for putting up with me all week. Um, oh, and my little nephew, Riker, his birthday is today. Happy birthday, buddy. Love you. Uh, ready to be home, hang out with you. So uh, we had a lot of fun. The big fish wouldn't bite. They just come out, look at it, nudge it. They, they'd nip at it. We tried everything and everything in creation to get them to bite. But uh, we're glad to be here. We'll see where we end up, and we appreciate everybody and everything. So, Did he get it all, Buzz? Yep. All right, guys, congratulations again. Looking forward to seeing you guys at Watchtaw. Maybe you can pull a twofer. What do you think? I don't know. That's a big river. We, uh, if anybody had never been there, it's fun. Um, scenery, rivers, um, big cypress trees. There's a lot of, lot of places to fish and everything. This Kentucky Lake, it's kind of like Lake of the Ozarks. That's our style of fishing, you know, big, big open um, ditches and haulers and everything. Um, there's... This was fun, but uh, we're ready to go to watch it all and don't expect what happened last year, but we're going we're gonna to give it our all. I guarantee we're going to swing for the fence. So. All right, guys. Thank you. Congratulations. Appreciate it. Good job, guys. All right, here we go. There's, oh, I get, I'll hold on their ticket. They just took off. They were ready to go home. So, All right, we're getting closer and closer, guys. You getting nervous yet? Feeling it? Uh. Don't size him up. It's a look, yes or no. Look at the guy coming up. That's next. right. Look at the guy coming up next. One of the best live scopers in the country, right? Oh, my God. I know. Let's find out. What do you say? He was in. The, whew, I mean, what place were you in, Robert, yesterday? Fifth place yesterday. Had 10.06. Got seven fish today. Let's bring up the Ranger Huckabee Rod sponsored pro staff team. Robert Carlisle, welcome to Championship Saturday. How you doing, man? Thank you. It's good to be here. Going to need 10.56 to move into the lead today. It looked like you brought up a pretty good sack of fish. There's seven fish in there. You ready to find out? Let's find out. All right, buddy, let's do it. For the lead, guys, need 10.56. You're going to fall. That's a hair under there. 9.61, two-day total of 19.67. Robert, congratulations. Great two-day total. I'm happy with it. Today was brutal for me. Uh, I'm just glad to have seven fish. It took till 11 o'clock to get seven one in the boat. 
Now, I've heard different stories in and out of these fish are moving in and out of these steak beds, and guys are fishing too close, they're scaring them, guys are way far away casting to them. What was your technique this weekend? I was uh, pitching a little 16th ounce jig uh, made by MCM Tackle uh, on my Huckabee rods, pitching out there about 20 feet to the, to the steak beds and trying to drag it through there and pick them off with a lot of finesse. But uh, honestly, I've seen guys that were right on top of them catching them, and I think I was probably being too careful. Well, congratulations on a great two-day total. Congratulations on kicking off your 2020 with your first top 10. Hope we see you again, all righty? All right. Thank you, Robert. Let's grab these fish and Mr. Ronald get some pictures when you come off. Thank you, sir. Now you're starting to smile. How about that, huh? I don't think we'll be up here for long. You don't? No. Well, let's see who we got left. We're down to four teams, so you guys excited? Let's do it. Let's do it. There's no more talking, is there? All right, yesterday they were in fourth place. They had 10-18. They are the... I never can read that one, too. Team CNO Marine, how's that? I always want to say Coco. I don't know why. Brett Luther, Robert Luther, 1018 yesterday, need 1044 today, got seven fish in there. Question is, are they good enough? Uh, they're good. What do we need? You need 1044. You ready? 1044. That's a heavy bag right there. I'm, I'm ready. Let's check it. Let's do it. All right, guys. See, he's kind of being a little bit evasive there. Let's see what we got here. It's going to be close, guys. Look at there. A little short, guys. 10, 12, two-day total, 20, 30, 32 hundredths off of the lead, but great, great two-day two furnish for you. That sounds familiar. That's kind of what happened last year, it seems like. Uh, we had a big time this tournament. We had a lot of fun, caught a lot of fish, and it's, um, you know, this lake is on a rebound, and it seems to be um, the quality of fish are what we're looking for, you know, the heavier weights than last year. So, How would you guys catch your fish this weekend? Uh, we single pole. They, I don't know. For us, it was minnows. Um, artificial bait didn't work as well but we um we just live scope try to we have some beds out there that we've marked we've made we've you know this is our home lake we um we enjoy coming out here and fishing this lake but it's um you know we saw a lot of fish we had a lot of fish come and uh nose the bait a ton yesterday um didn't have as many fish today do that but we um you know caught a, caught a good mess of them and happy to be where we're at i guess all right you want to talk about sponsors uh, thank you to CNO Marine, uh, SHR Talent, First Stop Outdoors. Uh, I want to say hi to my wife. This is our anniversary. She just got back from Florida. Uh, hi, Brady. I think he's in the uh, – there he is in the stands. Uh, thank you, Corey and Shannon and my mom for coming. And uh, thank you, Mom, for holding down the business this week. There you go. I gave him all the talking time. Did he miss anything? No, he didn't miss a thing. I just want to thank everybody back home. Appreciate it. Thank you for everything for me. All right, guys. Congratulations on a great top ten. You got awful darn close. Hope we see you at Watch Talk. Try it again, all right, buddy? Yes, sir. All righty, guys. Thanks so much. Appreciate it. Here you go. Three to go, guys. Guaranteed fourth. Uh, it's getting close. Yeah? Yep. Oh, the weights are going to get smaller, though, right? About to get even closer. All right, let's find out. You ready? All right, all right let's do it. They are our Janko Fishing Pro Staff team. They had 1028 yesterday. They do have a seven fish limit today. Home Lake for Mr. Mike Shepard and Tony Shepard. Big T, what's up, buddy? Welcome to Championship Saturday. Thank you. Thank you. You're ready, aren't you? I'm ready. Let's see what they weigh. Let's don't even talk. Let's, Let's find don't even out. Talk. We'll talk. After. All right, we're going to need 1034, guys. 1034 to put you in there. And we're going to fall here short there, guys. It's going to be 985 for a two-day total of 2013, guys. 2013. So close. So close. You're always there. Always there. Just always a little short. Crowd really liked it, though. It was a good finish for you guys here on Kentucky Lake. Yeah, we'll take it. We'll take it. How did you guys catch your fish this weekend? Uh, we caught them casting with the new rod I come out with, the Jinko Trick Stick Light. It's for casting really light jigs. Uh, we stayed back 35 foot and cast them. Used 10-pound braid, fluorocarbon leader. We just catch more fish doing that than the old way, so that's just what we've converted good, consistent to. catching, get you up here in a solid, yep. I don't know where you're at right now. You're in uh, fourth place. That's great, great finish for two days here at this lake. Yeah. You're going to yeah, come I'll, out with a check it. no matter what, right? That's right. Good for points. Let's talk about some sponsors here. I'd like to thank Jinko, uh, Abernathy Marine, Bass Cat Boats, the Bass Tank. You know, if it wasn't been for LiveScope, we wouldn't have caught these fish. Uh, the Iowa Reels, you know, we use ballistic reels. They're pretty expensive but i really believe we get more feel more bites with a smooth reel than you do a rough reel uh who else mike well we'd like to thank our wives they're out here sitting in the car they're hot they got his little one and and thank the good lord you know he kept us safe all week and cornfield crappie uh like to thank mark you know and that that's pretty well the prime one camo and 
That's pretty well to wrap for us on Kentucky Lake. All right, guys. Well, hey, congratulations once again. I sure appreciate it a bunch. Always good to see you guys top ten. You guys are a terrible meme wherever you go. Thank you very much. All right, we got a couple left, man. What do you think? Uh, Josh has some good fish. Yeah? Did you already see them? No. Oh, you didn't? How do you know they were good? He always catches fish. I know he does. My gosh, at the guy coming up. Well, let's find out. He's undoubtedly probably one of the best live scopers in the country. Let's bring up the second place finisher. Had 1046 yesterday, Mr. Josh Jones. Hey, welcome to Championship Saturday. How you doing, buddy? How you doing? Good. How was it today? Wasn't like yesterday. Fish were finicky. You know, I can make all excuses in the world. Uh, it didn't go as well as I wanted it to go, or I thought it would go, so... We're going to need 1016 to move into the leader spot. Let's find out what you got, Josh, okay? No doubt Mr. Jones went spider or live scoping today, so let's see what he's got here. You got close, but you're a little short, Josh. 935 for a two day total of 1981. Great two day finish for you, Mr. Jones. Thank you. <laughs> I know. Not what you wanted to finish, but let's talk about it really quick. Tell us about what happened out there on the lake this weekend. Uh, so I get here one day pre fishing. It didn't start out very well. Uh, side scan stopped working, didn't work all week bunch of other things but uh you know i did my best tried my hardest um thanks to act i fish a lot of uh big bass events and this is up there with the best of the best of the bass bass world so um i want to thank my wife she's at home pregnant she lets me travel across the country and fish for fun so uh that's it gonna get home to the pets and the potbelly pigs and enjoy yep. some fishing up in oklahoma and the tortoises and the tortoises i didn't know about tortoises yeah right on Josh, congratulations, a great top 10. It's a pleasure you fishing with us. Good to see you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Here you go, Josh. Sorry. Pass these back to you. There you go. Thank you very much. All right, guys, we're about to find out. Did you do it? I just did it. All right, why don't you come on up here? Come on up. Stand over here to my side. We're going to bring up a former national champion, some B&M Pro Staff Strike King sponsored team. Had 1062 yesterday. Got a seven fish limit today. Let's bring in Tony Hughes and Jeff Riddle. Going to find out who the champions are. But before we do, let's get all of our thank yous out of the way. Uh, I want to thank my wife for driving all the way up here today to watch this. Uh, we want B&M, Power Poles, uh, Millennium. Uh, it's a lot of people. Uh, Strike King. I'm kind of nervous right now. Can you tell? Yeah, I can. This is really going to be close. You think so? It's going to be real close, I think. Ten pounds is the number. Eh, it is what it is. It is what it is. Anybody you'd like to thank? I like, uh, my wife for letting me fish. Thank God for the health to be here to fish. And uh, anybody we forgot, we're sorry. All right. Well, let's find out who's going to be our next champion. You guys ready? Here we go. Ten pounds of scale, guys. Let's see what we do here. You're a hair short. 990, guys. You didn't do it. Petty Tucker, you guys are our Kentucky Lake champions. Congratulations, guys. You did it. Another close one here with ACT. Thank you, Jeff. Congratulations, guys. Appreciate it. You guys snuck it in. All right, now what do you think? Oh, it feels good. Oh, come on now, Matt. 2020, super clean Kentucky Lake champions. Guys, here, aluminum boat, 60-horse motor, tiller steer, steer, drove 20 miles south, fish your guts out. Look. Great, great job. You know, these are a men of few words, Jamie. I, I mean, know. we're going to have to pull it out. No. <laughs> yeah, I'm a man of few words because I just can't describe how much work it's took to get here. And uh, I don't even know what to say. I mean, I'm shaking. Just like Brian Young at the championship, what you guys do, it's just totally unexpected. Totally unexpected. Well, you did earn it. You did earn it for sure. Look, we're going to be back in just a second. We're going to present them a check and a whole lot more money. You stay Hold tuned. Guys we'll be up. right back. Hold them up. General Tire was born more than 100 years ago, right here in America. We've spent the last century tackling every kind of road this country has to offer, and especially the places without roads. So you know that with General Tire, anywhere is possible. 
Clean up your toughest messes super easy, super fast. Super Clean Floor Absorbent is formulated to do the work for you. Just apply and watch the spill absorb in minutes. Super Clean Floor Absorbent weighs only three pounds, so it's easy to pour and store no matter how messy the situation gets. For the one-two punch and stain fighting, follow up with Super Clean Degreaser for a like new finish. For all your greasiest, grimiest, toughest tasks around the house, shop, or garage, Super Clean gets the job done. Super easy, super fast, super clean. As a professional angler, my success is directly related to my preparation. In a tournament, I may cover hundreds of miles of water in one day. That's thousands of miles in a year just getting to the fish. I use Lucas Oil products to ensure my success on the water. Lucas Oil, made in America, sold to the world. Welcome back to American Crappie Trail, Jamie. The most important part, what everybody wants, is the cash and the boat. I got a check for Chase Petty and Braxton Tucker for $25,500. Guys, congratulations on a win here at Kentucky Lake, a hard, hard-fought win. Um, proud of you guys. Listen, you didn't really say much. Let's put this down here. Let's divul divulge it all. I'm ready. Where did you start? Where, you know, just area of where, where did you fish? You don't have to, you know, pinpoint it, but how are you catching them? Okay, so the lake was getting beat up uh, this whole week. I've been down here since Monday uh, morning, and I, when this whole quarantine stuff happened, I spent 40 days. I was off work 40 days, and I spent every single day on the water uh, because this live scope has just gotten insane. And I spent it here. I spent it on real foot. And, uh, but I found a bunch of places down here. My goal when I was off was just to come down here. I was, I was looking for this tournament and uh, was just to find a snake hole and because I knew these fish were getting beat up. But I had no clue they was going to get beat up as much as they did all week. So I went. Yesterday I fished the community hose is what I'm calling them. This is, and uh, we, we did what we could do. And today, if nobody knows, I... I have an 1860 War Eagle, and we carried 12 gallons of fuel, and we made an hour-long run all the way down south this morning, and uh, it it paid off because if it wasn't for that hoe, <laughs> we wouldn't have been here. And uh, on Friday or on Thursday, I, I attempted to make that run to see if those fish were still there, and I forgot my gas tank in the truck, so I had to turn all the way back. Barely made it back to the truck. So I was just hoping those fish were still there. We put up to the first state bed this morning. It was loaded, and uh, we just went to work on them. And Hi, right, you guys are pretty quiet, but i got to tell you something. What you hold in your hand is probably one of the most coveted cups in crappie fishing, as a matter of fact, in professional fishing, period. And now you're one of the few that are holding that. Tell me what's it feel like. I mean, I'm just blessed to be here and have somebody like Chase. You know, he was off 40 days. He'd come up here. He'd practice every day. And... I work a lot, so he does most of the leg work. Chase, what'd your fish come on? What'd your fish come uh, on, Chase? So we we used only hair jigs, small, small hair jigs. These these fish on the Tennessee River, not only this lake, but the whole Tennessee River chain, I've been noticing. They'll come up and nose it, you hear it, you hear it, you hear it. And uh, you, if you just got to be very patient b before you set the hook, and you can usually let them, you can, you can wind her up when uh when you when you know they're there and you're, you're going to miss a lot but we use small hair jigs we was pitching it as far as we could um that was they were getting very very spooky and uh like i said just lucky we had those fish down south that wasn't being bothered and we came up on the way back and fished a few community hoes and we caught up a few more pounds uh behind I ain't no telling how many boats and uh like i said it's light line um, braid attached to a leader we've learned we used to use straight braid we've learned that using a leader when those fish knows it they don't feel no resistance and uh that's that's pretty much it well, there you go well guys i tell you what twenty five thousand five hundred chase petty braxton tucker hold up those one more time your 2018 super clean kentucky lake champions congratulations folks thanks for tuning in with us live we sure appreciate everything you did god bless take care and we'll see you at watch tall river
Lucas Marine Oil. It's the only oil fortified with unique Lucas additives. <laughs> Just like Major League Fishing, it's environmentally friendly. Sweet. Lucas Oil means purpose-built, high-performance product. It meets all manufacturer's specifications also. Not running Lucas Marine Oil, it's like fishing a tournament without a boat. Lucas Marine Oil, it's that good. More than a century ago, General Tire was born, right here in America. Since then, we've made a name for ourselves by making tires you can depend on. Tires built to handle any road this country can throw at them, and relied on by every kind of driver. So you know that no matter where life takes you, with General Tire, anywhere is possible. B&M Poles, the number one crappie pole company in the world. tournament wins than any other crappie pole. BNMPoles.com. Clean up your toughest messes super easy, super fast. Only Super Clean is formulated to do the work for you. Just spray it on and watch the grease and grime wash away. Super Clean is the only cleaner degreaser that is scientifically formulated to kick any mess to the curb. So you can move on to more important things. For all of your greasiest, grimiest, toughest tasks around the house, shop, or garage, Super Clean gets the job done. Super Clean. Super easy. Super fast.